Hello. I I I'm Pat. Hello. Uh I'm Pat and I've decided to get a windscreen for the microphone to slightly improve the poppiness, the p -p poppiness of the audio. However, it has come with a slightly delicious side effect. Mm -hmm. That side effect is, hey, everyone, do you guys want to fucking, to fucking nut? Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, what happened to that new opening I showed off a while ago? Uh, I still haven't done the section, the, the, I haven't found a game that I want to, like, it's, it's for a, a fucking new segment I want to do, but I haven't figured out what game I actually want to do it for, so I haven't used it for it. <sighs> um, by the way, welcome everyone. Today is going to be a double, double feature. We're going to start with Black Tail, which is by Focus Home Interactive, uh, uh, they sent me a code and some money to play it on the stream today. Well, actually, they haven't sent me the money yet. They'll send me the money later after the stream. But regardless, it's for money. However, the game does look cool. So it's kind of a win-win for everybody. Um, is Crisis Core never coming back? Oh, hell no, it's not coming back. In fact, in, in two different... Uh, three different parts of that stream i'm like oh i'm just checking this game out this game is not gonna be a thing that that shit's gone you get paid by proxy uh in my happiness happiness my happiness is illegal did I see how big the Witcher 3's update is? Dude, I got the Witcher 3 update like last week on the console and I messed around with it and I talked about it on the podcast. So like, yeah, I did. It's good. It doesn't run very well on PC. I'm expecting them to optimize it a little bit. But I mean, we'll see. Ah. <sighs> It's almost like it's the whole game again or something. Yeah, kind of. So, Baller Swag, how do you, like, in what way, like, I haven't been following super closely, but in what way did it break the PC version? Is it just that it doesn't run as well? Or is it, like, other other issues? Because, like, I, I loaded it up and... It runs god awful. A forty ninety can't get to sixty frames. I mean, that's just literally not true at all. Cause my forty ninety gets it to a hundred and fucking forty frames. So like Works on my machine. Ah! Um. <laughs> By the way, I don't know if you guys saw on uh, on Twitter, but I have some Wi-Fi based news for y'all. So as you all know, I've been pushing the Wi-Fi 6 standard as appropriate for fighting games, much to the chagrin of co-worker and longtime fighting game pal uh wooly madden um uh, i was pointed out hey pat aren't you like a dog shit hypocrite motherfucker that you are like you had your twitter name as like red bars go die for like a little while 
And then you changed it to Red Bars Go Home. And I'm like, yes, that is me, actually. That that was me. In fact, I pulled up a tweet that was like, banished Wi-Fi users to the, to the internet dimension where 300 MS and packet loss don't matter. Ah. And that, that, was, that was when the big Wi-Fi discussion happened on the podcast. That was like a day or two later, right? So I went, um, I went back and I was curious. So that tweet where I was like, go die, Red Bars, was uh, on September 14th of 2019. Would you know it that the beginning of the Wi-Fi 6 certification program started on September 16th of 2019, two days later. And then the, the format was finalized on September 1st of 2020, which means that at the time of my red bar go die statements, Wi-Fi 6 didn't exist. I could not have known about Wi-Fi 6 when I made those comments. Revisiting the Wi-Fi situation in the year of our Lord 2022, nearly 2023, I must conclude that Wi-Fi 6 is a good standard and in fact suffers less than 1% of packet loss on average. So I am very, very interested in um, in seeing uh, our matches tomorrow on Street Fighter with Wooly. Because I, listen, I really want, I know there's a lot of people who play fighting games, and I fully expect many of you to watch Wooly's matches tomorrow. And by doing so, look at the matches in which I am playing against him. And I want all of you to take into account what those things look like. And if it seems like Wooly's being extra nitpicky about matches that appear to be completely fine. Because I fully expect a situation where the matches are actually completely fine and he can't tell. But his preconception is like, no, it didn't feel as good, man. Just, you know, it just didn't feel as good, you know? Like, ah, I, could, I can't quite put my finger on it. Wasn't the latency. Taraj, I get zero benefit of the doubt. I'm not asking you for the benefit of the doubt. I'm not. In fact, I'm asking you to not give me the benefit of the doubt. No benefit of the doubt. None. So Wooly's been laughing secret in secret this whole time? Oh, absolutely. Oh, he's going to kick my fucking ass in. And if he doesn't, if Wooly does anything less than beat my ass in tomorrow, then he has lost. <laughs> if he kind of beats me, maybe? Loser. D dog shit. <laughs> Ah, uh, I love it. Lie and say you figured out the Ethernet problem and tell him it was Wi-Fi on the podcast. Oh, who knows what could happen? I'm not going to be on stream. So the only person that will be able to vouchsafe my location is my wife, who, as we all know, will throw my ass under the bus super hard. <laughs> so 
So, so you can you can all rely on her. I'm so rosy tonight. Am I? Am I? I think I'm cool. I think I'm more of a Petey. Uh huh. You're pink. I don't. I'm looking at myself in the camera. In my cam, I can see OBS over there. I don't look that pink. That looks like me. I look that. I think I am that pink. Agni Brandt has probably the best idea I've seen. Start on the Ethernet, then take a break, and then move over to the Wi-Fi, and we'll just see what happens. That'd be interesting. That'd be really interesting. All right. Cause here, here's my ac here's my actual fear, right? My a my actual fear is that I don't think Wooly's internet is as good as it could be, and I'm afraid that his internet is gonna dog shit up my connection. Like you know, you know when all of a sudden I sound like garbage on the podcast? That's actually on Wooly's end. Anyway, let's thank some people and start playing Blacktail. This much copium will dana damage my sinuses. Brother, you can't stop it. No, I'm actually, hey, listen. I don't know if you guys knew, but I actually loaded up Guilty Gear Strive the other night and played about 30 matches with some random people off of Twitter and asked them to rate my connection. And uh, out of... 20 30 matches uh one guy said there was a one hiccup in one match i don't know if it's my good wi-fi 6 or the magic of rollback but it's fine now do get a wi-fi 6 router though it is a significant imp improvement is wi-fi 6 magic it feels like magic BK Mista, Angry Homunculus, and Mojo Mulder all subscribe. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. That's very nice. Dova Dude kicked in five bucks. Thanks, man. Sending it early in case I missed the stream. But a billiards bar opened up in town back in the summer, and me and Pops are going to check it out. Haven't played pool since 2015, so this is going to be fun. Have a good stream, King. Thanks, Dova Dude. Uh, your dad's going to beat your ass at pool. There's something about uh, men from the boomer era who like pool are really really good at pool unless that's just my experience um my my experience is uh my my dad and i want to play pool and then he uh sinks the entire table and i don't get to play pool and he bought a pool table like, it was his, like, he saved up for it for a couple of years, and he bought, like, a nice pool table. And no one would play with him because playing pool against my dad is watching him sink the entire table by himself. <laughs> it's the, like, like, you, you might, like, he, he might as well just play by himself. There's no, there's no difference. Ah, uh, Blue Wizard kicked in a sub. Thanks, man. Vampire Survivors just keeps getting better. Having a Christmas party Saturday to really break in the bar I built in my house. Wish me luck. Hey, that sounds cool. Drink responsibly. Limonol kicked in a sub. 61 months. Thanks, Limonol. Eight months more until the sex number. That's true, buddy. That's true. DX Lelouch asks, is my dad the Daigo of pool? You don't quite understand. Pool is... Like, there's a lot of games that people can get good at. A lot of people are really good at pool. Like, really, really good at pool. You can solve pool.
Didn't he get banned from a pool tournament? Yeah. He won it like three weeks in a row when they're like, you can't. You can't enter anymore. Kid Cal Rain kicked in a sub. Thanks, man. 20 months of goblins. I see it really is true. You either die a hero or live long enough to become a Wi-Fi warrior. The power of crazy talk is strong. Hey, man, load up the Street Fighter Six beta and come fight me. You have a fight with Pat Stares at, and the, the connection is appropriate to your general experience. What does that say? That's right. <sighs> says I'm the winner. Red Panda kicked in us up. Thanks, Red Panda. Scary Boy Supreme kicked in us up. Blacktail, I thought you only used the, the Red Nine. <laughs> Good one. Oh, I got this. I got the sleepy. I got the sleepy brain. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, da, 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 da. what's fighting stick I'm rocking? I forget the name. It's the new Hori. Uh, I'll go look it up. My orders. It is the fighting stick alpha tournament grade from Hori. Uh, it's really nice. It's a really nice stick. I like it a lot. It's it's got super super like sticky uh, rubber at the bottom, so it doesn't move around, but it's also pretty light. I like it a lot. And also, it's the first arcade stick that I've used from Hori that doesn't have um, completely smooth buttons, like slick arcade plastic. It's, um, it's matte buttons, which I was like, oh. and then I was like, oh, that's really nice, actually. It's a very nice stick. Centurion sub. Thanks, Centurion. Smoothwood also sub. Thanks, Smoothwood. Oh, great, Orbed One. May you accept this humble patronage and bless upon me and others' fun and jokes this evening. No, I don't want to. All poop tonight. No, that's not true. We'll have a good time. Taraj kicked in a sub. Thanks, Taraj. Tried to get this added last month, but it never was, so trying again. Still Twitter banned, so I have no other way. Let's see if we can open this and turn the sound off. Uh, it's not porn. It's being added to the list. How do I add this to the list? I'm not allowed to add this to a list. Well, I can't add this to a playlist. That's pretty funny, actually. Let's see if I can add it manually to the watch later list. Can I add it manually? How do you add things to this ad video? URL. Add. Add. I added it. I think. I think I did add it. I did it. Don't say poop pussy. Don't do that. I don't like that. Ah. Gustav the Eighth kicked in us up. Hey, Pat, have you beat a game? Oh, shit. Uh oh. Ooh. Paige is going to be coming out here with coffee and some lamb at some point. So, that's nice. But boy, I got some... I got some sleepy time. Pat, if you beat a game, how much do you go into finding out secrets or extras you may have missed? For example, no, I, I don't do that anymore. It makes me crazy. Uh, if I encounter it, that's cool. If I don't... Well, for example, after waiting for you to beat God of War Ragnarok, and also not to spoil myself, went to TV Tropes and found out the difference, minor spoilers for God of War Ragnarok, between the spelling of two characters' name with an accent. I edited that donation so that it is not a spoiler. Also, what happened to Live Live? I stopped playing it. That's what happened to it. Hey, people are like, hey, when are you going to get back to that? I'm probably not. Uh, I, I like to play new video at, video games, um, and uh, if the old video game falls away, I'm probably not going to go back to it. Very sorry. Gloom Tangerine kicked us up. Hey, two years, any chance of you doing the Street Fighter Six beta tomorrow? I am not doing... Uh, hold on. <laughs> Ta-da. Mm 
I am not doing the stream of the Street Fighter 6 beta tomorrow uh, because uh, I already did. Also, Paige is going to be beating Disco Elysium tomorrow afternoon. Or at least make a valiant attempt. That's right. That is the plan. Um, uh, so tomorrow I will be uh, hanging out in my pajamas playing video games by myself. Well, actually, I'll be beating up Wooly on his stream. And testing the power of Wi-Fi. Wizard of Diamonds kicked in a sub. Thanks, Wizard of Diamonds. I'm gonna t I'm gonna warn people right now. This is a really incredibly confusing donation message. It's an incredibly confusing donation message. All right, here we go. Uh, there's a big insurance. There's a big question in my state. How do we stop people without insurance from going to the hospital? Well, my insurance premium was going to jump by 150 bucks, and when I applied for a new plan via the government, it was determined that I didn't earn enough to qualify for the cheaper plans or for tax credits toward the, taking the edge off of my premiums. I think I know the answer to my state's question. How about you guys? I got perfectly fine insurance now, by the way. So I'm going to be really blunt. I don't understand what you are talking about. I, I don't understand. Um, what do you talk, like, if I'm scared that my broke my hand, I go to the emergency room and wait for eight hours and that sucks. But like my money, my money machine don't factor into it. I don't like to wait eight hours, but I mean... No, I know what an insurance premium is, but I have like house insurance, right? I know what an insurance is, but I don't understand the question of how do we stop people without insurance from going to the hospital? I mean, you could shoot them in the face if they don't give you their health card upon walking in the door. I don't know. Like, I don't know how to answer that question. You've had people suggest that, but then you still have to provide medical care because they got shot. And when you have a minor cold, the Canadian doctor offers you a noose. Yeah, that's not going. That's that's becoming weird. That's not great. I didn't know. I, I I'm I'm a little concerned about the state of uh, uh, my national health care being uh, staffed by low tier god. Uh, Kagan of Astora kicked in 500 bits. My wife said, I can think of 14 reasons to leave you, plus your obsession with tennis. I replied, that's 15 love. Um, I don't know what... So I get that it's a tennis joke, but I, I don't understand why in tennis they call it... Why does it go 15, 30, 40, and why do they call it love? That seems really stupid. It seems really stupid to me. They should just have 1.2.3.4. Uh, to answer the people uh, earlier, the confusion about uh, the, the Canadian doctor noose, uh, we have a, uh, a system that passed in the country called uh, MAID, which is basically uh, medically assisted interventative dying, I think it's called. I might have gotten the I wrong on that. But basically, it's... Uh, it's basically if you're like a terminally ill old person that it's in horrible pain, uh, you can just be like, hit, hit the button, bro. Give me the juice. Um, however, uh, as soon as the program started out, we've had like people who are about to lose their apartment who are handicapped be like, yeah, just hit me with the juice. I don't want to become homeless. 
and some doctors are like recommending it for people with like bipolar disorder or borderline personality disorder and it's like i don't think that's what that's for um built into the system is you got to get multiple different doctors to sign off it, on it i foresee this being upped to like 10 doctors at some point Dan PC5 kicked in a sub to say, insert a message. You fucked up, dude. <sighs> you fucked up. NPC Mimic kicked in a sub. Thanks, NPC. Hope you're having a good hope you're having a good day, Wi-Fi Warrior. Oh, dude, I was playing Elden Ring and Final Fantasy uh, 14 earlier today on my Wi-Fi's. And it was completely fine. Currently fighting off some cold I got from a coworker, but I'm looking forward to relaxing in bed while watching. Well, get plenty of liquids. Get your rest. BT Robot kicked in 500 bits. Thank you, man. Congrats on getting uh, to play Blacktail. Can't wait for you to play the vastly superior Red 9. By the way, for anyone watching the sponsorship, that is a Resident Evil joke and is in no way a reference to the actual quality of the Blacktail video game being published by Focus Home Interactive. <laughs> Jared, but not with Subway subbed. Thanks for causing Wi-Fi 6 to exist, Goblin Man. Appreciate you. I really, I, I need to take credit where credit is due. Um, me being such a sanctimonious prick um, about uh, not playing on Wi-Fi caused Wi-Fi 6 to manifest into the good Wi-Fi. Flesh Goat kicked in a sub. Thank you, man. Skelmo's such a mood right now. Stay strong, Skeleton. He will not. Necro sub. Thanks, man. Hey, here's some money, funny man. Do you have an idea for a new move for Geef to get in SF6? Yes. Uh, if I if I wanted to give Geef one move, I would give him Clark Stills Argentine Backbreaker with the hard button. Uh, people who are not familiar with that, Clark Still has two Argentinian backbreakers, which is his command grab. One is really fast, and you can combo into it, and the other is a little slower, but has a hit of armor. Uh, Zangief actually already has a historical precedent with a move that has a hit of armor, which is his running Siberian bear grab uh, from Alpha, where he gets a hit of armor as he runs to you. Uh, yeah, no, just give hit, just give like strong SPD, a longer startup, and a hit of armor. And see people just get mad. Like, mad. Mad! Zero Arturia kicked in a sub. Hi, hi, Wi-Fi Warrior Pat. Can't wait for Choo Choo Charles. Any plans before the re RE4 remake? Like a pro run on OG RE4. I have played RE4 so many times. I don't want to play RE4 on stream again. I've played through it at... L I want to say at least three times on camera. That's enough. Good luck fighting Wooly on the SF6 beta. It is most certainly going to be a test of your reflexes. Thanks. Thanks, Zero Arturia, a.k.a. Xenos. Unknown alien sub. Thank you, man. Hey, Pat. Thanks for the streams as of late. I have gotten back into fighting games to get others out. <sighs> Love it. Shout out to my friend Dara for letting me teach him that lesson. <laughs> so mean. Wolf EX sub, so the Monkey Tom Lord and Roggle Jr. who said red. Thanks, guys. Andrew of Bob kicked in a sub. Man, thanks. 
Thank you for playing the Vampire Survivors on the stream. Your fun convinced me to buy the game myself. It's like the random bullshit go meme, except it's a cloud of well-planned bullshit for eating eggs. Anyone that hasn't picked it up should do so. I'm restarting Vampire Survivors on my telephone. Um, it's... Um, it's, uh, fascinating to me that Wooly played Vampire Survivors on the phone and then was like, I did, oh, man, you gotta be in portrait mode. I'm like, it's, there's like, there's like two buttons in the options, dude. Broke us almighty sub to say Stumbo King. Thank you. Roast and pheasant sub. Thank you. You may not remember because it's been a long while. Uh, but you asked me to let you know when I got signed by an agent. Well, I got my website and my demo, so I'm going to be sending in stuff shortly. Things are going great. Good for you, pheasant. Good for you, man. Strachilia's kicked in a sub. Thanks, man. Hey, Pat, got a Steam Deck. What would you recommend for it? So far, it has been a vampire survivor's machine. Uh, I would recommend the critically acclaimed award-winning MMO Final Fantasy XIV, which is now free up to level 60 that includes the Heavensward expansion. <sighs> Cappuccino Gil kicked in sub. Hey, Gil. Hey, man. How you doing? Job hunting still sucks after all this time. Who knew? However, hopefully might uh, have some good and even great news in January. Can't wait to hear your thoughts on Choo Choo Charles. And now I'll go fight Paige in 14. Have uh, fun. And Rothel Mag kicked in a sub. Hey, Pat, is there any game for 2023 that you're particularly looking forward to at this point? Um, it's it's become very difficult for me to remember when games are coming out. Uh, I really genuinely have a really hard time uh, remembering how many they come out nowadays. Uh, but the three top right now are... Um, Final Fantasy 16, Street Fighter 6, um, Silk, Silk, Silk Song, Silk, Silk Song, Silk Song. <laughs> That's right, Cope Song. I mean, there's also Hades and the RE4 and the Baldur's Gate, right? I'm wondering if I should play the Baldur's Gate 3 now. And whether or not it'll be, uh, what do you call it? Different enough in August. Uh. Nailed it. All right. Up to me, what class? Probably Paladin. Probably. I like Paladins in Baldur's Gate. Mm. Oathbreaker. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. That's everybody now. So, what we're going to do is move you guys over here. Hold on. Boo -doo -doo. You guys are going to go live over here. Hello, chat. You're over there now. Um, oops, I closed a window I didn't want to close. Uh, and, yeah, you're, you're, you're on the side dimension. Sorry about that, Ranryu. Oh, Dapper Cactor sub. Finally hopped into Hades after getting it on sale on Switch. It's great. Oh, it's super great. Oh, man. All right. Let's uh, have a little sip of water. Mm. All right. So, sometimes when I get a sponsorship, they give me a list of talking points. You know, hey, look at this. Hey, check it out. Uh, I'm now realizing... I don't know if I actually... I was about to say, there are no talking points! And then I'm like, wait a second. Maybe I didn't... Maybe I just didn't read that email correctly. 
Um, maybe I'm stupid. It's possible that I am a stupid idiot. Hey. This is the wrong one. This is the right one. Is it possible that I'm stupid? Is there a chat command for it? That's right. There's a chat command that's called exclamation point blacktail. It'll give you a link to where you can go take a look at the game. Uh, there's also a, a little little description box down at the bottom of the of the stream if you scroll down. Uh, I want to thank. I want to thank, by the way, Blacktail and or Focus Entertainment for sponsoring the stream. Thanks a lot, guys. I appreciate it. By the way, if you want to buy Blacktail, it's on the PS5, it's on the Xbox, X, S, and the PC. And you can uh, buy the game yourself by clicking those little links that I provided for you. Oh, we do have some, we do have some, oh, here we go. Here's, here is, ah, I found it. Here we go. Ah, I found some talking points to talk to you guys. Pat's status, dumb, it's possible. All right, let's see. This is also helpful to me. Become the guardian of the woods or the terror nightmares are made out of. Forge the legend of Baba Yaga and live out its origins in Blacktail. A one-of-a-kind blend of intense archery combat, magic, and dark storytelling set in a vi vibrant fairy tale world. You play as Yaga. I mean, that's a little on the nose if you're going to become B Baba Yaga. A 16-year-old girl accused of the witchcraft and expelled from a medieval Slavic settlement. When living memories of your past return as foul walking spirits, you are left with no other option to hunt them down in hopes of unraveling your own mystery. Decide the aid of the land as inhabitants with this, the impact of your decisions on your skills through Blacktail's morality system. Track down elusive spirits with your trusty bow and gauntlet and engage in thrilling boss fights. Craft arrow and potion, hunt wild game, gather resource, and survive in the ominous woods. Find treasure to learn about more of your surroundings and history. And collect lost recipes and brew elixirs to improve your abilities and shape your Playstyle. By the way, if you want to look up more about this game and type in Blacktail into Google, I would highly recommend posting the phrase Blacktail Game as uh, it's the name of a sheep? No, of deers? It's the name of a deers. Uh, so if you just type in Blacktail, you just get a bunch of photos of deers. So uh, be aware. It's not a deer. It's a video game. It's a video game you can buy right now. And with that, I'm going to hit this button. Wow. Did you see that? Was that not cool? Wow. Baba. No, not Baba. <laughs> ah, not Baba Yaga. Black tail. Oh, man, I'm an idiot. That's just how it is, bro. I'm just a dumb, dumb idiot, man. Can't believe people get me to do their sponsorships when I'm like a stupid moron. All right. Mm -hmm. Should see you guys in just a second. Unfortunately, I think you're going to miss the Focus Home Interactive logo. You did. It was a good one. Sorry, guys. By the way, a photosensitivity warning. Warning. There might be some uh flashing lights and shit so if that's the kind of thing that fucks your balls up be aware profile one profile two. Oh, interesting video that's just fine gameplay english subtitles on please thank you no nah, i don't need that i would like that though let's new game it oh it's already there thank you Next, please. That gamma is just fine, thank you. Story or adventure? I like how these aren't actually difficulty uh, selectors. It's like, just, hey man, what kind of game do you want? Do you want, do you want to just hang out? 
or do you want to like brutalize your 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 wounds with casts made out of dirt? Ooh, ooh, what am I looking at? What is this? The mixer's turned off. Wait, do you guys not have any sound? Wait, yeah, you you have sound. I just saw sound. There were two twin sisters, Zora and Yaga. It was well past curfew. My sister sneaked out of the village. I followed her, as I always did. I took my bow. Ooh. Can you guys actually barely hear? Yeah, thank you. Oops. You causing me to miss things. Yaga! I'm coming. Chosen one. Man, this interface makes me think of Skyrim bowing and arrowing. Ahead. Ram of Vodnik? Holy shit, that's fast as fuck, boy. Gross. That's fast as fuck, boy. I always make arrows myself. This time wasn't any different. All I needed was some sticks and feathers. They drop stuff? Oh no. Oh, thank you. I wasn't actually tutorialized on that, but thank you. I always make arrows myself. This time wasn't any different. All I needed was some sticks and feathers. Hmm. I think the tutorial just told me I'm stupid. Stick acquired. Is that a... No, it's not a bird. Don't worry about it. Huh. How am I gonna get that bird? And a bit of work to put them together. Now, how am I gonna do this arrow crafting? I see. I've used games inventory like this. Arrow acquired. Zora is always up to something. Can you see it? See what? The tree. The red oak. The red oak. Short distance shot, long distance shot, power shot, aim. Got it. We've often used it for target practice. What if I shot these fucking targets, bro? Ooh. Got him. Take a good look Fuck. At My bad. If anything bad happens, always head straight to the Red Oak. I will meet you there. Uh, Zora? Was it you? Can't stand a second without a leash around your neck. How about you finally go down your own path? Fucking darkness! I, I just want to survive. No matter the cost. I always tried to think about what's good. Me. Trying is all you could ever do. <laughs> you got it all wrong. Once upon a time. There was a freak with no face. Is that me? How much longer you want to be a nobody? You just follow in your sister's footsteps. How far will you go when she's not around? Zora's got a, a plan. She always has one. It's time you had a plan. You want to hide here in the woods? You can't hide from Baba, princess. I, I just need to find the red oak. The red oak. <laughs> If anything bad happens, stop it! Then forget the goddamn oak. What you really want to find is 
Baba is me? What? Am I the Baba? Is it drilling into your little head? The hut. The hut. Damn, bitch, calm down. Just another bad dream. But if Baba ceases to be, then who am I? I haven't had a good night's sleep since Zora went missing. I think I finally know where to look for her. But first, I have to get some food to get my strength back. What do you have for me? I need to kill a deer. Oh, hello, Grimoire. Vitality, antidotes, this shit, more of this stuff. Fletcher, knock knock, sharp arrows, sharpshooter, dash, glass slippers. Huh. And I, what I need certain. I need honeys and flowers and a pine cone to get that. Commit good or evil acts. Your moral stance will affect some of your skills. There's some place that'll judge you every time you visit, altering your moral stance. Let's see. Favorite queen and specialist. I could be e bees are evil, motherfucker. I don't know if you know that. Bees evil. Very mean. Very, very not nice. Almanac, people. Yaga, Zora. I see. Missing pals. Journal. Hunt deer. Inventory. I have one heart. I don't know what this is. Let's go find a deer. Hey. Well, that's fun. Right. I keep having nightmares since Baba the Witch started snatching kids from the village. Oh darn that Baba. Volko. Slavitsa. Dragoy. Can I get a flower? Yes I can. What are you? Weavers of life. Keep on spinning my thread. Okay. Shrine is idle. Let's see. Granting of the Weavers of Life a flower offering might win you fortune's favor. Using a red herb may save your skin. Use these to save your progress. Oh, interesting. Okay. The shrine is save. Well, this game has a really cool art style. Hey, it's a bird! Mine. Thanks, bird. Your sacrifice was not in vain. <sighs> Fucking bird. Nice. Wait, morality! Are they mad at me because I killed that bird a little bit? They probably are. Yeah. Oh, no, you don't. Hell yeah. Look at all these, look at all these resources I'm getting. Oh, but I can just, I didn't need to do that, huh? Hmm. Oh, well. Your problem, one. What the hell are you? Is that a hedgehog? It looks like it wants the fruit. Just couldn't stop myself. <laughs> fruit is mine. My fruit now. Thanks for letting me know where the fruit was at, brother. Oh, it's a 
big one. I hope I can take it down. Sprint, huh? Ooh. Gotcha. Wow, this arrow shit feels great. Feels like a, a better version of the Skyrim arrow system. Which, as you all know, I am a huge fan of. A big fan of. Oh yeah, I'm crushing this. I have many arrows. Hmm. Oh hey, it's more of those spirit dogs. Uh, birds. Confused. Crouch. Ooh, crouch is down the D-pad? That is a very deliberate stance. I hear bees. Do you guys hear bees? I love bees. Bees are my friend, and they're your friend too. Oh no! Well, that's what I get for not paying attention. Flower. I'm loving this game's art style. This is fascinating. The village. I can't go back. Not without Zora. All right, let's headshot this motherfucker. Fuck! No, that's good, man. Wait, how do I- Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, if you just hold it for long enough, it goes away. I see. Alright, let's see if we can- I want to headshot him. Like, just really blow his head right off. You know what I'm saying? Got him! He's tough. It'll need more than one shot. Y'all saw that shit. Y'all seen it. My Joe Rogan now? It's entirely possible. Oh, you bitch! I wonder, can I hit him from here? Yeah, I can. Delicious. Shall flow through my heart forever now. Because we are one. Now meat goes over the fire. I'm hungry. I am extremely hungry. Oh man. Ah, there we go. Oh, oh cute little map. I see it. How's that? Active quest, got it. Oh, huh. Interesting. You know, it's funny, I saw a spider. I saw you look at that. A bite from that spider can kill in seconds. I'd better fix myself an antidote. Just in case. That is a motherfucking skulltulla right there, bro. Eyeball. Mmm. Delicious. What is that? Is that an arrow? It was an arrow. But why? What the? These monsters trap birds just for fun. And try to force them open. Mm. 
Yay. Damn it. I wanted to. People have always accused me of helping Baba. Called me a, a freak. When Zora disappeared too, there was nobody left to keep the angry mob away. So here I am. Finding my sister is my only option now. I gotcha. Need to get to the Red Oak. Hold up. I need to, you need to calm down. Got him. Could have set the bird free. Ah, I've, I've dis I'm discovering, I'm discovering how to do the bad things in situations. I'm sure the bird appreciates that. There's my fire. I've now looped back. cooking what the huh oh what a cool little mechanic so far so good looks fine huh Here's good statuses. Here's bad statuses. Mm. Looking for a lost sister. A lost spirit. Bro, you see that dude hauling ass? Flower. Flower. Whoop. What the hell is wrong with this forest? Probably some Slavic magic shit. Probably. That's what I'm thinking. Mm. Hey, it's a little owl cone. They might have a few remarks. Should you knock them down? Oh, that's that's morally uh neutral. Dank hut. The one we saw three years ago. The same that haunts my every dream. Wow. It's like <sighs> there, but it's also not Just there. Sneak a peek. Look for any sign of Zora. Look at this. Look at this bunny shit. Oh hey, it's this, hey, look at this guy. What the Bruh. Bruh. Oh, hey, kitty cat. Hello. Did I just pet the cat? I think I did. My mask. It's trembling. Cool. Flesh house. Interesting. The cauldron. Get new skills here. If you've already collected one, you can breathe a potion of vitality now. Potion of vitality acquired. Oh, I see. You need scrolls and whatnot for this. But then this, I need a tooth. I need some bee stuff. Need some uh, balls. I need a pine cone. I need teeth. Looks like my, uh... Looks like I'm, I'm just held back by teeth. My total lack of teeth. Oh, where am I going to get teeth? 
goat, raven, snake, and hare, huh? Oh, some of these are birds, some of these are goats, some of these are dog, etc. Mm, oh, look, there's my deeds. Bird trap, bird trap, bird, hedgehog, bird. Again, but this is not a dream. Well, shit, it isn't. Surprised? Don't you remember all the times I saved your ass before? No. I... What do Better you... Better get used to it. This time I'm gonna stay for a good while, princess. I'll also help you get out of this mess you're in. Um... The Man. roots have overgrown this place. Ugh. We'll deal with it. Oh, is this... The one who watches over the world. Cool. But look what's happened to him. And to the world. Let him feed off of what you've brought. Press the seal. The seal? Your mask. Oh, I thought she was going to push her face into it and be like... <laughs> Gross. Finally, I can feel something. The voice. Evil, bad voice. Oh, I love this. It's little cookies, but the cookies got a bite taken out of them. Is it still? Oh man, that is such a cool design. A trail of crumbs. Those goddamn kids always get their crumbs in the yard. <laughs> got you, bitch. Oh my god, it's so Sorry guys, I did not get much sleep last night. Very apologetic. I'm a big I'm a big sleepy boy. Can I pet the cat? I think I did earlier, but it didn't have a specific animation for cat petting. See the vines? Yeah. Whoa. Not bad. Hocus. Short range force wave pushes shit back. Wow, suck it. Wow, this feels so much like the Skyrim in a really good way. Rushmans! If I'm too sleepy, guys, I will just uh, kick um, Choo Choo Charles to a later date. I don't want to play Choo Choo Charles when I'm, I'm falling dead ass asleep. I'm doing good now, but you know how it is. Stand here forever now. I could try jumping over. No. Figure out something. Now she's yawning. Give me a break. Oh, I didn't even realize. Why do I have a zombie arm? Make myself a fishing rod one day, but I don't have one now. What I call a good winter. You're oh, cool. You're the giant mushrooms I heard about in old folk tales. I never thought you'd turn out to be real, though. What are you? Oh, oh, shoot. 
A human girl. And she's holding a bow. Should we? Wait. This mask on her face. Don't know why exactly, but it makes her look almost familiar. Not many of your kind coming here. Have you lost your way? I there? think so. Oh, I like her bow. It's such a nice bow. Uh, can I touch it? Did she come alone? Uh, where's she? Keep it down, kids. Can't you see the grown ups are talking? I'm. I'm looking for someone. And, well, the trail goes over the broken Ooh, bridge, hard. so. But see, Borvi? The bridge is broken. Borvi? It must have been the fire drake that burnt it. You mean a dragon? A vile, bloodthirsty reptile? No way you've got a real one here. Of course we haven't. A dragon just happens to be the best cover-up for whoever's behind that honey hustle. Honey hustle. Huh? Anyway, they call me Borvi Borko. Hey, Borvi. Slippery Jack at your service. Slippery Jack. Ugh. What kind of name is that? <laughs> What's that short for? Quit your jabbering. I can't hear what she's saying. Would you... Would you happen to know another way across the river? Oh, there is no other way, I'm afraid. We could rebuild the bridge for you, but... Or rather have a bunch of beavers do it for us. Oh man, I love we beavers. Sure They're so cute. Do this, but we need to take care of the fire drake first. <sighs> Tell me more about dragon. Dragons used to be something you would rather hear about from the elders. Stories about beasts breathing fire, eating sheep, but honey. The beast, this bloody hole eater, built its nest somewhere in our forest. Sometimes it sticks its ugly head from a cave and demands offerings. Honey's enough for it now, but the spring's just begun. It might grow hungry for meat or mushrooms. What a pile of rubbish. There is no bloody dragon, just greed. Vice and deception. Honey is liquid gold. It rules the world, corrupts people. No wonder someone's using that for their own benefit. And we still can't afford to lose a single drop. Anymore. I want the bees. The bees are on the evil path. Right the Sith path own. of bees. Imagine how much cooler Star Wars would be if Emperor Palpatine shot bees. I wonder if this, this terrible, mighty dragon and uh, lost spirit I saw a while ago could be linked somehow. Did you happen to see it too? Oh, a lost spirit, huh? I'm afraid I didn't. The restless souls reveal themselves only to whom they choose. And sometimes they can carry lost memories. Lost memories? Yes, the ones you both share. You have to follow the spirit and relive the memories so the lost soul can finally rest. Some say it's nearly impossible. I bet it is. You may lose I'll never get that memory back of getting my dick sucked right. at the Costco. But trust me, it's worth the risk. Said Baba Yaga. Because by helping the spirits, you might help yourself too. Mm. We all carry our own burdens. Ah, uh, yes. Such as the fire drink. All right, I will help you. It seems you've got a really burning issue here with the beast on your shoulders. But I really need to get across the bridge. So maybe we can help each other out? You seem like a crafty lass. Help us get rid of the beast, and we'll get the bridge fixed for you. I can do this. Well, I'm not exactly a dragon slaying type. Oh, I'm sure you'll do just fine. Jumbo Crunchy back. says, oh, Pat, you've never had your dick sucked at a Costco, and that's why I'll never face. get that memory back. Even if it's a bit hard to tell, <laughs> he'll tell you what's what. Dragon or not, this thing needs to be taken care of. But you should start by finding my friend, Duh. the noble Grand Knight, and get yourself a good luck charm, such as a horseshoe. <laughs> In any case, you should follow the dragon's roar. The roar. <laughs> Just go to the caves west from here. All right. I'll see what I can do. Watch be some guy. There be dragons. Great adventure I am. Hang in there, Zora. Wherever you are. All right. Let's take a look. Huh. Fire. 
Borvi. Excellent. Hey, here. Oh, it's a kitty cat. Hey, kitty cat. Wait, what? Oh, are you fast travel? Kitty cat, are you fast travel? I wish Elmo could do that. Oh, it can save your sorry ass. You gotta learn every way to crawl out of your own grave. What the fuck is that? Toad bag. Any resources you'll come across that won't fit in your pockets will be munched upon by the toad. You can get them back by interacting with it. Oh, it's like the God of War thing. Oh. That's great. So you don't have to worry about resources. All right. I'm going out exploring. Ooh. Oh, hey, little guy. I see. I see what I should have done. A crystal wool. Curious. Not One getting through this shit. Shatter. Or you will. Keep moving. That did not work. I don't know why, but I thought that was a pile of V's. Alright. Oh, no way down there, huh? I think I knew this place. I was here, like... It's been a year now. Painful memories? Good. Pain means you're not dead. Yet. Is that a fucking bee? What? <laughs> the sinister lights leading you straight to hell. Willow wasps. I like it. That is a pretty good name for that. I like that. Bees. Booberries. I don't think it's Marceline, but there's definite Marceline energy coming off of it. Is that a rush man? No, it's nothing. I'm loving the feel of this. I wish I wish I could impart to you more accurately how it feels. Oh fuck. Oh, fuck. Well. Is that a little ant? Tremble before our might, puny mortal. Soon, the rivers will flow with the blood of all who dare to oppose the eternal empire of ants. I... I beg your mercy, my Queen Empress. Enough. Show me the way to the human settlement, so I can lead my merciless army and pour my wrath upon them. Okay. Lead your armies past the lake, my Queen. May your conquest be swift. Soon, all will know the true meaning of horror. Land folk. Helping her is not commendable, but might give you rewards. Hell yeah. And Ooh, I made it. I, I guess I accidentally came to the right place. I didn't even... Ooh, what's... Ooh. I didn't even intend. Oh, that's a heal. I see. 
I see, I see, I see. Gotcha. Wait, can I headshot these bees? I can totally headshot these fucking bees. Bro. Ah! I see. All the time and work to build these and only one arrow to break it. <laughs> You're such a monster. Fuck it, give beef. Beef. Here's the thing, man. I need fuck it. Oh, I just oh. I don't think that's gonna I don't think that's gonna fix the shit I've been doing. I like this part where getting resources is about jacking nature up, and everyone's like, Oh, bruh. You don't gotta jack nature up like that, bruh. And I'm like, yeah, I fucking do. Give me the bees. Give me that good bee shit. Excellent. Whoa. Huh. Gotcha. Excellent. Yeah, man. Man, I played Factorio. I played Satisfactory. I will... I will fucking strip mine the entire Earth until there is nothing left. Nothing left. Ooh. A two. Finders keepers. You can be interesting. Oh. Back of the hook and finally become a huh. hero in your own story. <laughs> Bruh. Bon appetit. <laughs> I got a tooth. If I remember right, the tooths allowed me. Oh, I... What? Ah, up. Ah. What a strange button. The tooths will allow me... I need three. I need two. I need one. <gasps> glass slippers. There's glass slippers too. Pat's the kind of guy who roots for the humans in Avatar. Yeah, their robots were cooler than the Navi. Look back. I heard stories at times of green wood, a full moon. Everyone can be turned into a resource. Hell yeah, stick bug. Strip mine the entire earth. I'm going to do it. I can constantly hear footsteps around me. It's really messing with me. What is this? Is that ants? Are you my friend? Take that, you bunch of crooks. Ah! At least around here. I see. Ants are bad. Ants. Here's the thing, I think ants are cool. I really do. I think ants are my friend. How's the game so far? It is very interesting. Very interesting. That was a mistake. She's 
swims, she's a witch. If she drowns, she wasn't. So... did you drown? <laughs> More teeth. Hmm. Huh. I'm supposed to find the rebel around here. But I'm having a little bit of a trouble. Maybe. Aha! This. That's not a dragon. That just looks like an asshole mushroom. I'll be damned! Look who's there! <laughs> it's some giddy goat at large. Looks like the noose didn't hold you tight enough, huh? <laughs> Not tight enough and not long enough. Nothing can hold me, girl. You must be Jack's friend. He sent me to have you get rid of- The dragon? Ha! <laughs> Good old slippery Jack. Always the best in bending the truth. The dragon, as well as his famous appetite for honey, is just a fraud. The honey itself is a real beast here. It's what's making folks madder than a wet hen, clouding their minds. I can see each of you has this whole thing figured out differently. How about you get your story straight if I'm to help you? Woohoo! That's the spirit! I love it! Rage on, burn through! You're exactly who I need right now. <sighs> can we stop beating around the bush then? Ha! That's what I like to hear! Listen, there's a will-o'-wisp den nearby. I see. The critter's been holding heaps of honey in there. Heaps of honey. Build this thing, Majiggy, to turn their cave into a cave if you catch my drift. Their nest goes boom. We get rid of the bugs and what's more important of the honey. But I want We're the honey. We're not letting it put us in irons, turn us into mindless. But slaves. I want the honey. But first things first, we need the plans for the damn uh, thing. That's one solid plan. It seems I'm not getting across the bridge anytime soon. Relax. I got people in places. <laughs> They'll help the geezers with your bridge. If you help me. So, yeah, the plans. You gotta snatch them from Matt's castle. Bobby Boko's friend? Why don't you go get the plans yourself? A cursed free bird like me? Now, These mushrooms are all assholes. Round them holier than thou grand posers. I'm allergic to their BS. All right, all right, all right, all right. Any more questions on the job, or are we ready for some honey flavor? Yeah, so the dragon's not real, huh? You're saying honey is the real problem, but what if the dragon is- Oh, come on! You're not gonna tell me you believe there's a drake around here, are you? <laughs> You're better than that. Anyway, it sure ain't our problem right now. I'll get my people to help the twins with the bridge. Wait, you have people? This thing is getting sticky. Every mushroom seems to be involved. Regardless of what their shape or color is. Ah, yeah. They're cursed, down to earth, living the moment folk, like yours truly. And there's Grandies, who think themselves better than the rest because of their long expired do's and don'ts. Uh huh. Curse. Did someone give you the evil eye? What have you done to get punished with such an ill fortune? Well, they used to call us that to make us seem all bad and all. But tell you what, we embrace that. Yeah, we're cursed. Cursed with freedom, baby. <laughs> Just the right people at the right time to free the land from. I don't know if he like. I can hear a monster right, into my direct I right. To get my hands dirty, or sticky, for that matter. Music to my ears. Now, meet me at my place as soon as you got it. Anything wrong? Can't you hear it? Some vermin coming this way. Don't have too much fun. <laughs> there are too many of them. Oh, that is actually too many of them. Whoa. It does that? I used to hate this thing. Stuck on my hand. You've almost figured it out. 
That fancy gauntlet of yours. Learn, act, repeat. One day you'll get the most out of it. I like the part where I killed them all with my blood. I don't think I can repeat. The cauldron has all the answers. Which apprentice skill has been unlocked? You can now brew it, provided you have the shit. All the unlocked recipes can be viewed. Press Y over to skill to learn more about it. I'll try. Ah. I now have the ability. I need lots of lost pages, huh? Interesting. Need a I need one flower in order to. Hello. You're not gonna let me, huh? Darn. Suck it. Oh, fucking. Oh, boy. You know, making sure I have these fletched might be a good start, huh? Maybe a little bit. Stickbug. Sorry, Stickbug. That's just the way it be. Okay. That was... That was tough. Don't run around aimlessly. Got it. Oh, I'm glad it auto-saved on me. Yeah, I did lose quite a bit of health. Oh, fuck. All right. This way. Oh, it's not footsteps I'm hearing. It's birds. I'm hearing birds. Obviously. Charge the power shot, then hold R to it's for a special treat. Change the active special treat. Now, make it special. Boost your shot with the gauntlet's energy. Oh. How the hell? Right now, I have an oh, area of effect I'm shot. Somewhere. Ooh. Now, what was it the mushroom wanted? Fight the night. That's not where I want to go. I want to go this way. All right. Where does it want me to go? Well, there's the black cat. Wow. All right, we out there, huh? Oh, that's just helpful. Fuck. Got it. Going out with a bang. That's a huge behind. I'm sure it's full of honey. Mmm. Delicious. <laughs> Delicious honey. Ooh, I'm running low on birds. I gotta be careful. Real low on birds. Well, 
that definitely worked out. <laughs> Thanks, birds. You know, this would be a lot harder if, uh, I didn't have all these birds to eat. You know what I'm saying? Luckily, I do. Hey, what is this thing? Bellas, king of the underworld. Make my path run with blood of my foes. Guide me down the night. It runs. Totem. Oh, I'm getting a little bit of health juice out of that. Excellent. All right. Kitty cat, fireplace. Looking good. Hey, kitty. Wait, hold on. May your hand be just, but your shears patient. Now, kitty cat. Don't know what that is yet. All right. What are you? Oh, I see. Let's make... Fletcher. I can... Ah, oh, I'm missing two. Could I find two flowers in the near vicinity? I probably could. I could probably find a flower right here. Yes. Yes. Hey. That's a little snaky move. What's over here? Deflect Hocus, Witch Apprentice. Interesting. All right. Back we go, Mr. Kitty Cat. Chat is weirdly silent today. I wonder if there's some kind of Twitch issue, or maybe I'm just wildly unpopular. It's always possible. They're all pissed out. Yeah, that's how it be. Take that bird. Gotcha. That bird got owned. <sighs> well, I got a long way to go before I get to that night. Oh, look at all those birds. Hmm. In the old ritual statue, they spilled those to ward off the winter. Days of yore. It's the one we were making a year ago. With Zora and Jagoy. <sighs> BT Robot says, sorry, Pat. I got so mad at Wooly playing Mass Effect wrong that I went back and replayed the trilogy myself. See? Let's players cause value. Look at that, look at that value increase. Oh, this is pretty. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's the, the that weird cum monster. Hello. Bird. Ooh. Ooh. Quick Quake says it's obvious that Wooly and Reggie have zero shooter experience. What are you talking about? Wooly played through like all the Halos and uh, used to play Apex Legends. He's got plenty of shooter experience. Hey. This looks evil as fuck. And there's not much for me here.
He didn't know that the the reticle um, showed you your power cooldowns until Mass Effect 3. Well, here's the thing, right? That makes perfect sense because, you know, it's like a fighting game. In a fighting game, you don't tend to look at your character on the screen. You tend to look at the opponent on the screen. So, in that case, uh, if the reticle is like your own character, you would never look at the reticle itself. You would actually just look at the enemies and then just kind of try and forget where the reticle is. What the? Gotcha. Tooth. Oh, I fucked that up. Thank you. Well, thank you. Huh. Oh, there's a kitty cat to my left. Ah, it's a deer's. Oh, I missed the deer's. Wasn't paying attention. What is that? Got it. Sneaky poison mine. Aha. Take that, you dumb bees. You fucking idiots. plants. Take that. Dude, shooting these birds is a blast. I'm loving it. I'm loving shooting the birds. Like, look. Ah, oh, he's... No, I can't get him. Oh, no. Oh, except I totally got him. Oh, no. Bees. Why would you play this game as, as a good person? Look how many more bees I get to shoot. As not a good person. I get to shoot many, many, many more bees. As a bad person. Can Paige play this with bees? No. No, she cannot. Hair hex. Oh, okay. You can carry three more arrows of every type. All received healing is more effective. Oh, so, you know when you're sleepy enough that, like, your back starts to get sore? Huh. I need to have... Uh, hey, hey. Can carry through. Oh, I have to learn more snake or goat skills. I see. I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Being able to carry 12 arrows seems like it rules. That, uh, that away. Oh, near that cool fucking thing. Got it. What is that? Are you alive? Are you a friend? What is that? What is that? Oh, it's Mushroom Man. It's a sign of Mushroom Man.
Oh, hey, more cool ants. Mm. Human! I, the ant queen of the unstoppable empire, demand proof of your loyalty. I want you to slay the birds in the name of the ant queen. Bring me five. My queen, I have fulfilled this task already. Please. Accept the trophy I present you. I see you are no stranger to the art of war. This will not go unawarded. Ants are my pals. Pals with ants. Thanks, ants. Take that bird. Hit. <laughs> the fuck is that? Oh. Gotcha. All right. I see the deers. Oh, fuck. Headshot. Blessed be your gifts, mighty forest spirit. Headshot. May your paths always be filled with plenty. Ah, oh, good old FPS, Doug. Remember FTS, Doug? Oh, I do. None of you do, though. That's all before your time. Is that the fucking knight? That dude looks huge. Wait, no, that's a... What the f... That's just a fucking mushroom. I'm here for, uh... I know who you are, you filthy uh... wretch! Rebels sent you to steal my plans, didn't he? I may not have regained my full strength after the winter, but it'll be more than enough for a maggot like you! On guard! On guard! Oh my god, I love... I love that he's got, like, a little... night guy on top of his head. Oh. Oh, fuck. Bro, I got owned. Bro. I forgot I had a dodge. Don't worry about it, though. Oh, I have a good dodge. I'm here for. Uh, I know who you are. You. I may not have regained my full strength. Weeds, orphans, all the same. Weeds, orphans, all the same. Ha! Get out of here. Your mother did you for a reason, didn't you? Man, I really like that um, his health bar is actually really small because he complains about not being full health. You can make a shame, but death is so much better. Whoa. Hey. Get out of my face. Gotcha. There it is. Defeated. I am unstoppable. Oh. He just became he just became like a smaller mushroom. Bare knuckles, you hear me? That's cute. See, he's fine. Oh, that's evil as shit. No, 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 no. Where is that piece of work? Oh. Um, is someone there? 
Oh, Man, these mushrooms be all over the place. I, 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 I can't. Is that? Oh. Um, I don't quite know what you. Is it you? It is. It's really, really you. Oh, I've been waiting for so long, and now all my prayers have been answered. Haven't you been? By the way, if you guys like what you guys have been seeing so far, feel free to check out the uh, link in the chat or the link down in the description. Go check it out yourself. It's Black Tail. Wait, the mushroom here. He's dead. Just a little dead. He's dead. I mean, he'll go back, but then you already wishlisted. Yeah, that's that's a step. The dragon is safe now. We can. Wait, there is a dragon. Have it. You want to own a dragon? Yes, all for you. We'll make it eat villages, burn princesses, or wake one up. Oh, the beauty sleeping in the grove. You grabbed it 20 minutes ago? Cool, thanks, Eldalu. I hope you have fun with it. So you think Beast is real, huh? The cursed aren't exactly like-minded, are they? Rebel said. <laughs> Rebel? He hasn't seen enough. He hasn't heard enough. He hasn't smelled enough. He hasn't... Yes, I think I get it now. Please, accept this jar of honey. Take it to the dragon's lair. When the dragon sticks out his head, grab it, pull it out, and fly it back home! Look, the other mushroom asked me oh, to... sure. You can go tell him you've got what he wanted and do his little silly, silly little sabotage. Or... You are smarter than that. We'll be unstoppable when we have a dragon. Hold on a second here. Who the heck are you anyway? Oh, I'm cool as fuck. That's who I am. You're testing me, aren't you? <laughs> Mom's the word. Did I pass? What a wacko. Yes, you did. Well done, my trusty. Lord. I feel like I'm gonna find out that every single mushroom is like connected to one big mushroom heart. You know? Just a nightmare fucking beast. See me at my place when you've got it. I can hardly wait. Wait for these nuts. All right. Is this the mushroom you killed? What happens when it grows up? It's between us. Serial killers. You kill it again and again and again. Man, I love that lady's voice. She is extremely morally gray. All right, we're off to now. Back here. But how do I get there? Huh. You know, I'm doing really well with the curse, the lunar, and the uh, bees. Mm. Go to the dragon's lab. Okay, well that just seems to be my only option right now. Suck it. Hmm, I wonder if I can go over this way. Oh hey, it's one of you guys. You should go to Bees. A Bobok minus a mortal soul makes a Shellock. Mm hmm. And? Their souls trapped in between, awaiting their chance. We've all been there. Have we? Oh, what happened to these guys? Huh. Hey, that looks like an evil hell spot. I'm going to touch it. Huh. Interesting. 
where would I find five red? How many I got right now? <sighs> Almost none. Oh! That might be Megara from the Hades. She's got that, 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 that drawl. <coughs> Oi, miss. Miss, uh, moment of your time. Oh, uh, good day to you, Mr. Mr. Lava. Not a very good day to be alive, I gotta say. All under words are rage. The others protesting, lost souls reading around, and made tunnels blocked by those awful roots. Gotta dig the terrace. It's got me all twisted. Tell me, miss, did I go up or did I go down? Up is down and down is up, Mr. Lava. Oh, yes, that's so. Thank you, miss. I should get back to work. Demons aren't going to make themselves, are they? Trolled. Suck it. I said something that I knew wasn't true for the lulls, guys. You know it. You know that's the good stuff. Like the fact that rats can swim. See, now that would be really dramatic misinformation. Immoral, too. Like, how are you how are you supposed to catch a rat in a water trap if you're unfamiliar with the fact that they can't swim because somebody told you that they could? Okay. All right, got him. Take that, you dumb bees. Hmm. You know, I don't really have... I very much like... Oh, hey, kitty cat. I very much like the... Ooh, hey. Ooh. Hey, there's flowers over there. Ah, oh, crap. You'll teach a rat to swim just to spite me? Good luck with that. Everyone knows a rat can't swim. Their tiny rat bodies are much too heavy. You'd never be able to do it. I just got four. Lit. All right, so now I actually, I think I have the ability to, uh... No. Oh, hello. Hello. What do we got going on in here? I am not supposed to be here. You know when you just... Oh! Hello? Hey, spiders. Okay. Well, I definitely don't know how to get over there yet. For whatever reason, this is reminding me of, like, grounded. Did you hear that noise? That sounds like birds. But it's not birds, is it? 
stats. Quite a lot of them too. Bloodthirsty bats. They taste a bit better than their non-wing counterparts. One would be wise to avoid the weaponized sound waves. Getting hit by one can result in dizziness. They also bite and swarm. Watch out for that noise. Holy shit. Now, better keep my guard up. I can't open it. Too stinky. Yeah, I can't. I can't fuck with these guys. This whole area is way too strong for Pat. Pat must escape. Escape, Pat. Escape. That is a Skulltulla, bro. Like that, that was spooky. Hey, I found the kitty cat, but I actually want to get back to like over here, I think. I don't know. Over here? I don't remember. Oopsie. Huh. Hey, look, I. You should go to Boo and Snuggle. What are you guys talking about? Fuck. I'm. Oh, damn. Eh. Eh. Got it. How do I get back? How do I get back to, uh,. What is this, anyway? Oh, this tree's alive. Not just in the obvious sense. Every time I... Oh, there is one over there. Yeah, I got a honey pod, bro. I gotta find that offering, man. I know I'm good to go on it. I'm totally good to go on it. But I can't, I gotta find it first. Wow, I didn't even see that, bro. It's this way. There it is! I found it. You that good shit, Satan. I want it. Oh, look at that dog. Uh, 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 rabbit. Blessed be the world tree. Its crown in the heavens. Its root in the underworld. What? That was a good one. Huh. No, it's not. It's all the benefits of the moral spans opposite to your current one are at my disposal. Interesting. Very interesting. Alright, let's get back out of there. Let's go kill the dragon. Dragon is this way. Ooh, bird. Oh, what? Hey. Anybody else? There we go. Thank you, everyone. It's... It was a bunch of sticks. Thank you. 
I'm gonna ask, how does it feel to have a, over 800 people here for this super interesting game? But you had over 1,100 people watching you have a perpetual panic attack for Dwarf Fortress. I don't know, man. Dwarf Fortress is a, a game that's like 20 years old. This game is brand new, and it's very interesting. But as a result, you're unlikely... The, the possibility that I shit my pants from anxiety playing this game is almost zero. Never zero, but almost zero. Um, because it's like a, a good game, and it appears to be made for human beings uh, to play and enjoy. Whereas Dwarf Fortress... Um, is made by, I don't know, non-humans? Definitely feels that way. Any other skills I can get right now? No, I don't have enough teeth. Dwarves is too easy. I just saw you, kitty cat. Calm yourself. Oh, flower. Those flowers that are rare. Oh, hey, man. What's up? <coughs> mm. Oi, miss. Fancy seeing you again. Ooh. Miss, I'll be honest with you. If I don't get sticks and stones to break old bones, soon there won't be any room left for new corpses. I already have some stones, but sticks are illegal in the underworld. Do you think you could discreetly help me out with, uh... Well, um, my wares are beyond your reach. This time we'll be getting some low-quality sticks elsewhere. Oh, no. Velez will surely fire me, or cast me into the fire. Still, there won't be any room for my corpse, or any corpse for that matter. Fucking get owned. Man, you can book it without your, uh, without your bow out. Uh-oh. Take that, fuckers. That was mean? I know. Uh-oh. Gotcha. Gotcha again. Yeah. Look at those bees. I'm running low on sticks. Gotta keep my shit out for sticks. I'm loving being an asshole in this game. I'm finding it incredibly satisfying to stomp nature and burn it. Like, ex extremely, extremely satisfying. All right. I'm an idiot. I just spent like five, six minutes going in the wrong direction. Time to roll. Well, you can really book it. Holy shit. Let her go. Holy shit. Nice. Huh. Alright, this way. I didn't notice that up there before.
Uh, is it harder to be good than bad? Looks like it. Oh, hey, man. Looking for trouble? I sure am. Bro, you're cool. A free soul is a rare sign. And two of them in one place? Mm, reckon it's gonna be a cold day in hell. <laughs> How did you two? Well, this is a cool fucking design. Nice done, girl. Give me the papers now and let me have a look at them. Mm -hmm. Easy peasy. <laughs> New quest. What? Do I still have the old quest? Oh, looks like it. No honor among thieves, huh? <laughs> Our march to freedom needs just a little push. <laughs> You're saying honey is the real problem, but what if the dragon is- oh, come on! You're not gonna tell me you believe there's a drake around here, are you? When did that get there? <laughs> You're better than that. Anyway, it sure ain't our problem right now. I'll get my people to help the twins <laughs> with the bridge. Don't Thank you, sweat. darling, for- for lamb. Always been fuck off. Always this been there. It's getting sticky. Every mushroom seems to be involved, regardless of what their shape or color is. Ah, yeah. There are cursed oh, down oh, wow. earth, live in the moment folk like yours truly. That's an excellent one. There's grandies who think themselves better than the rest because of their long expired do's and don'ts. Curse. Did someone give you the evil eye? Well, I already asked what about this. Oh, well, they used to call us that to make us seem all just. All right, I'll see what I can do. All right, one second. Gotta have this lamb. Oh, gotta have a good bite of this lamb. Ah. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. That's good lamb. All right. Complete the bomb. What game is this? This is Blacktail by Focus Home Interactive. Hmm. I need to read this a little more carefully. Ah. The next step is completing it. Hmm. Can I go around to the right? Ah, stupid dog. Calm down, kitty cat. Hey, can I hang out with you guys? The Gnolls camp. Well done. That's right place, right time. Keep quiet. Oh. Is it actually Ganol? Oh, 
<laughs> How nice. Someone came to dinner. Too bad he didn't give us a chance to tidy up the place first. So much dirt everywhere. I guess we need to at least sweep the floors. What is this? What? Yeah! Get over here, you little piece of shit. They can't resist it. Wow, I got fucking beat down, bro. I got fucking destroyed. So I didn't have enough lamb. <laughs> Gotta get that lamb. Mmm. Oh, that was great. Holy shit. Looking for trouble? I sure am. Wait, really? Back here, bro? Oh, Jesus. I marched. Oh, okay. I guess it doesn't really matter because I was actually fairly close by. By the way, guys, if you haven't tried out Bandit Lamb, I highly recommend you trying out Bandit Lamb. It's one of Paige's best things she makes. Oh, it's great. And you know what the other thing that's great about bandit lamb is? If you make it, or somebody else makes it, and you have it, and you're eating the bandit lamb, you can just start going, ah, oh, blah, blah, bam, blah, damn, bam, bam, blah, damn, bam, bam, blah, damn, and just annoy the absolute shit out of them for multiple days. <sighs> like I've been doing. Well done, Miss Wright. Place right get over here, you little piece of shit. <laughs> they can't resist it. <laughs> Take care. What the? There we go. I did it. Was it? Gnolls. The brute's culture seems primitive. They're territorial, militarily aggressive, and their language sounds harsh. Yet their understanding of the world may not be as shallow as it seems. They also seem to like pointy hats. I feel like these gnolls are actually gnomes. Is that possible? D uh, a broom? Broom? An ancient artifact of great power. But sure, it makes it easier to take care of the trash. But what was it even doing here? This thing's got a mind of its own. It found you. It'll be back if you need it. So, a bound to stick together for thick and thin. Yes. I'll ride it wildly. Hey, thanks for the raid, Spear. Howling wind and, uh, Are you finished? Don't push it, princess. What do I got? Two teeth. Hell yeah. Uh. I'm loving this band of blam. Bam ba dam. Bam 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 bam. <laughs> so stupid that I say these things. Leaders of life keep on spinning my thread. I think it's really funny that I'm like using the um, extremely like. I'm totally chill with nature and shit. Um. Prayers. But I'm like, hey, is that a dog? Bang. Is that a cat? Bang. It bit me. Oh, I can feel the poison. I need a cure. A cure. Mushroom? Other mushroom. Take that. What bit me? I don't know. That's weird. Huh? 
Oh. Now I've got to push it closer to the cave. You you can't be serious. Oh yes. That works. Oh. Oh, that's weird. Oh, that's fucking weird. That's real, that's real gross. Oh man, we got lots of stuff going on in here, man. Bam, da damn, bam, 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 bam. I think my favorite part about me doing that stupid bam, da damn shit is that um, I don't, I don't, I don't know anything about the song Black Betty. Like, nothing. Oh my god, I'm getting fucking wrecked, bro. Huh. Oh, I'm done. Oh, man. Wow, this game just kicked it up a notch. Huh. All right. I don't know what kept poisoning me, though. That was a little frustrating. Bam, da down, bam, da bam, 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 bam. Fuck. <laughs> Bam, damn. If you want to play this game without having to listen to my annoying ass bamba dams, you could go down and buy it yourself by using the links provided in the chat and the description. Yeah, I'm gonna ignore those knolls. How about that? Yeah, how about that shit? See that? Now it's big brain time. Now it's big brain time. What the fuck, dude? Did you see that? Oh, it's the... the yeah, you. Hey. Hmm. You're cool. We need weapons of war for our enemies to cower in fear. I'm afraid I'm no blacksmith, your highness. A bow and some arrows is all I've got. Arrows! A strategic resource for the conquest. Bring me five arrows, and the Empire of Ants will annihilate all that stands in its way. Okay. May the Legion of the Ant Queen accept my offering. This shall not go unawarded, my soldier. When am I gonna get rewards from these ants, bro? that a, a golden imp quick after it it'll pay off okay meg there are no pickpockets they'll go for the big prize rather non-invasive specimens will never fight back instead they flee away dropping pieces of their great wealth they'll get lots of treasure ore. oh my god it's so good Where do you fucking go? Oh. 
I don't get. This is a fucking dead end. Where do you fucking go? Yo, what the fuck is that? Fuck is that thing? Ooh. Oh, it doesn't. Oh. Hmm. Nope. All right. Well, that imp's a piece of shit and lied to me. How could an imp lie to me so? I just don't know. You're done though. I don't know what language these guys are speaking, but it's fucking hilarious. It sounds like Muppetese. You know? The guy the guy to the right on the mix is do be do like man, he sounds like a Muppet, big time. God, I love Muppets. Man, as soon as I came to this part of the map, it fucking stepped up. No poison. Huh. Push the deer towards the cave. But. Well, where deer? Save, please. All right. Hmm. Hey. I just tried to think. I just tried to workshop a deer, bandit lamb joke, and it didn't. It didn't work. It didn't work at all. Hmm. Well, I tried. Fuck. Alright, let's roll. Oh, no, you don't hit nothing. Too fast. Fast as fuck, boy. Fast as fuck, boy. Oh, hey, man. Oh, God. Who, what? Okay. These ganoles are incredible. Whoa! Crawling out the earth now. That's weird. Am I just blind? Do I not see the, the fucking... Wait, what? Oh, you know what I have to do? I have to actually follow it. Oh, this is gonna be rough. This is gonna be rough as fuck. This is gonna be rough as shit. Why does deer look like that? I think a mushroom built it. Yeah, I think a mushroom built it. 
All right. Go. Yes, that works. Holy shit. Why are there so many gnolls, man? Where'd the fucking thing go? Where'd it go? I immediately lost it! Oh, hey, man. Oh. oh my god, these little fucking assholes. Damn it. I want to see what these guys actually drop. That's one. Damn it. He left again. Wait. Oh my god, these oh no. You know what? Let's just try to explore with my dying breath. No, not there. Oh my god, they are every- oh my god! Oh, this whole area is extremely vital and mean. Yeah, it is kind of like- did you see him throw- did you see him throw that thing? You see that? Okay, I gotta really pay attention. I gotta really, really pay attention. All right. Dog. Go. Oh yes, that works. Oh my fucking God. All right, where's he go? Where's he go? Where's he go? He was there the whole time? He was there the whole time. He was there the whole time. And I just couldn't see him. Just a little bit further. Just a little bit. Just a, just a little tiny bit further. Yeah, this dog is not working well. Oh! Oh, this is so intense. Why is this so intense? The rest of the game was relaxing. That was fucking hilarious. I think it was gonna blow up in my face. <laughs> oh! All right. All right, let's do it. All right, let's fucking do it. All right. How are we gonna do this? We gotta kill the gnolls. It's the only way. Uh. 
It's the only way. Fuck. All right. Null number one. Defeated. Null number two. Also defeated. All right. Oh, I'm already almost out of arrows. Bro! You little freaks. Oh, yes. That works. All right. Progress made. That running animation is killing me, man. Killing me. Hilarious. Just a little bit further. Fucking hilarious. Like, it's so misshapen. Oh my, oh my god, where did... How's it do that? Come on, man. Oh my fucking god. Okay. Antidote used. I feel like... I feel like every time I look away from the thing, it just immediately evaporates. Stop looking away. It's... it's hard? It didn't go back, did it? <laughs> Quantum deer. Oh, if only. All right, no, it didn't go back. So it went this way. Right. And then this way. Right. And then... Uh... If it went here? Is where the where to go? Like where to where to go? Am I crazy? Do do you guys see it? Oh my god! It went so much further than I thought. I am now out. I now need... I now need materials. That's not fair. That's not fair. Oh. 
I'm gonna go save again. Holy shit. Oh, 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 no. Oh, man, this is bad. This is real, real, real bad. I thought Choo Choo Charles was supposed to be the horror game that I'm playing tonight. I'm fucking terrified out here, bro. Go! So trash. But <laughs> well, everyone. Failing the deer is gonna leave us at the end of tonight's show with <laughs> with the Baba Yaka story <laughs> with Blacktail. So this is a good game. I think it is. I think I've just trashed this one section. Or maybe this one section is a little overtuned. I'm gonna go get more of this lamb. That's what I'm gonna do. Alright, so make sure to check out the description. It's got like a little picture down there. Or like the link in the chat. And then I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go peace out, get some more lambs. And say Bambladam. Then we'll be back with some choo-choo Charles. Alright. So I'll see you guys in like five, ten minutes. Okay, bye bye.
Let's go. I just spilled an entire glass. I spilled this entire thing of water directly on myself and my legs. My left leg is soaked like I pissed all over myself. Except it's cold, like cold piss. I will not show you my wet feet. <sighs> so like... Hey, foot perverts. I have a question for you. Because I know there's a couple foot perverts in the chat, unironically, right? Were there less of you before, like, 1995? Or were you just, like, ashamed? Because it feels like... It feels like after Kill Bill came out, like all bets are off pulp fiction what the fuck happened with feet in pulp fiction Dancing scene? Really? Man, I don't even see it. I wonder if it was because of the internet. It's probably the internet's fault. It was like... People were like into it, but they didn't know that there were other people. So they were like, got to keep it big secret. Got to keep it big foot secret, right? And then 
And then the internet was like, I'm going to make this fucking silicone foot that has a pussy in it and fuck it. And people were like, wow. This guy's got a good idea. So I asked this because I just had to take my socks off because my socks were too wet. So my stinky feet are marinating the the floor juice directly underneath. I think, I think the idea of me saying, oh no, I pissed on my feet and somebody goes, ew, piss. And I'm like, oh, so that's the line. I want to meet the guy who's like way into piss, but thinks feet are disgusting. And so if you pissed all over someone's feet, they're like, I don't know what to do. upset now I am upset <laughs> so I'm having a really strange experience right now where um usually you know when you know when there's a room in your house and it's really quiet and it's always really quiet ah <clears throat> But then one day, it's like really quiet. That's what the office feels like today. Like, there's never anybody in here except the person streaming, right? And the dog and the cat rarely come in here. But for whatever reason, it's like hyper quiet. And I, I, can, I can hear my own fucking ass clap. You ever fart really hard on a wooden chair? Yeah. Earlier today, I was walking through the kitchen, and I was like, hey, Paige, I love you. And then I started burping, like one of those, like, <clears throat> one of those, and then started farting super loud at the same time. And then I went to hug her, and she started to, like, cry. <laughs> yeah, that's... No, not a real cry. I like the nah, nah, that one. You know, you know the like, you know the like the pathetic wail that Paige does. All right, time to. Uh, Time to thank some more people and then play the true choo train game. I want to thank Ligma Lomitsik who kicked in a sub. I'm glad you noticed how abysmal 2042 is. Somehow shells are pushing that it's good now. Totally. Yeah, so Ligma is referring to a clip I retweeted of a sniper rifle in Battlefield 2042. Um, that is a railgun. It's like an Unreal Tournament railgun. It's a it's a battlefield sniper that doesn't have any bullet drop. Um, and I'm looking at it and I'm like, you, you can't, you, you can't, <laughs> you, you can't, you can't have a gun like that in a game like Battlefield. What are you stupid? Oh, 
Are you good? It's fucking dumb as shit. I'm still interested in trying out Warzone, even though everybody says it's bad. I really want, I like the way Warzone plays. Let's see where, where Warzone's at right now. Mostly negative. Dear God, still? Still? The top positive review I just saw of Call of Duty Warzone 2 is, is it normal to be called the N-word even if you're Asian? Well, that just says it all right there. That just says it all right there. That's fucking wild. Taraj, stop it. I got a guy in the chat who's like arguing with the mods about the the spelling of Maine Coon and why the auto mod keeps uh, destroying it. Uh, it's it's auto modding it because part of that cat breed is a violently racist term against black people. So stop trying to talk about it and getting around the auto mod. The auto mod is doing it on purpose for real for a good reason. General S.E. Patton, perfect. Stop rules lawyering racist stuff. Well, you see, I used it with the A instead of the E-R. Therefore, Why are the COD lobbies at like 500% volume too? I don't know, man. So, I've talked about this a lot. There's a lot of insanely toxic shit that happened back in the day in the actual Modern Warfare 2. Back in the original era of like, hey, everyone's got a microphone. Let's see what that's like. Answer, awful. But the number one thing that happened... You know, you have like eight-year-olds calling you every racist thing in the book. That's that's wild, right? But the one that always got me, it, it, like the only one that like got into my heart and hurt me in my heart, was like playing like let's say Bad Company Two, and you're doing like a thirty-five-minute conquest thing of Bad Company Two. And there is a guy in your squad that has a baby, and that baby is screaming in, like, terror or, like, agony or, like, please change my diaper or something. And he's just like, yeah, no, no don't worry about it. And you're like, and like, it's this, th it's this, it's this like wonderful human moment where you have like dipshit child, young adult, and like old man who doesn't give a fuck anymore 
all of them going like, dude, dude, you go. Dude, your baby is crying. Ah, just ignore it. No, 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 your baby. Dude. Oh, oh, the worst. Because you always have that. You always always have this thing in your in your heart of like, am I listening to like a neglect crime happening right now? Like, am I? Is this match gonna finish? And he's just gonna play fucking Call of Duty all day, and like the baby's gonna like fucking starve, or like get picked up by social services. Like, oh. Oh, terrible. I got into a lobby once where a guy was getting pissed off and went to get the baby and woke up the baby to cry to the microphone. Wow. You know, I'll say stay toxic. Oh, but boy. Ooh, that's ooh, that's toxic. Ooh. Oh man. Yeah, <laughs> that's radioactive, Bucket W. Yo. Oh. Modern problems require modern solutions, that's right. Oh man. Oh. Good old days. Hey, Fanciful Frights up. Thanks, man. Not sure what to say here, but I'll point out that Armor Core 6 is inexplicably coming out next year. They've been working on it for four years. So that's why. KJ Sandwich sub. Thanks, man. Uh, Dark kicked in a sub. Why would I share this shit? No one cares. LOL. That's the spirit. Thanks, man. Grimlock Fly sub to say what up. Thanks, man. Dara, Dara Kagura subbed. Just a little shout out to my bud, uh, Mr. Unknown Alien, for trying to get me out of fighting games, but instead awakening my co competitive spirit. Coming for you, bitch. Thanks, Pat. Hey. I like that. I like that. Sferi rated the channel. Thank you, Serious Age Advice. Really appreciate it, man. Stoop Kid sub. Thank you. Iron Oki also subbed. Hey, Pat. Thanks for the content. Even the sponsored content, especially the sponsored content. Ah, you know what the best part about sponsored content is? Sponsored content is the security blanket that allows for dog shit content. But also the money. The money, okay, the money's the best part. But but the money is a safety blanket. And the safety blanket man means man, you can you can play dog shit for a couple days. <laughs> You can so like there's there's one thing. Um, what's that gentleman's name? What is that gentleman's name? He looks kind of like me. He is a red man. He uh, he a red red man, a little orby. He got glasses. He played the Final Fantasy fourteen. Jesse Cox, that's the guy. All right, so Jesse Cox is on Twitter and um, when he was talking, so you saw uh, like a uh, 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 fucking. Shroud and Dr. Disrespect and Hungrybox were all going like, Bruh, there's nothing to play. Oh, I just want to play a good video game. There's nothing to play. Um, I think Hungrybox was the absolute most insane person in that objective, right? Because, like, the other two were playing, like, relatively new games, right? But Hungrybox has been playing, like, the same game for, like, 20 years. It's like... There have been like four new games in the series that you're playing that you could play. Um, and I made a, I made a joke at their expense. Like I have so many fucking games to play this week that I'm doing half streams, right? I'm doing stuff like Baba, sorry, not Baba, Blacktail. And then I'm doing like Choo Choo Charles, shit like that. Uh, but Jesse Cox did bring up a point, uh, which is that uh, if you're streaming for content, if you're streaming for the hot hot content and let's say i'm not super familiar with disrespect's channel but i know he plays a lot of uh like modern warfare right now i think 
Um, and he plays a lot of like brand new competitive first person shooters, right? Plays COD. Okay. Yeah. So a lot of people go to his channel f uh, to see him play COD. And if he were like, hey, motherfuckers, it's time for Persona 5, they would dip. They would fucking leave. Um, and that's one of those things that you have to take into account. I didn't want to do that, which is why from the very beginning, from the very beginning, it was um, fucking Variety, right? From the very beginning, it's like, hey, this, this. I still remember my favorite story. It's a guy saying, hey, man, you you doing a lot of Battlefield? It's like, nah, we're uh, we're doing a Let's Play of Star Fox Adventures in an old wrestling game. <laughs> right? Um, and Middle of Chaos and, and shit like that. Uh, but it is, it is a thing. Like, Ninja was, like, top of the goddamn world for a long time, right? And then Ninja got tired of Fortnite. And he's still super successful. But, like, he's nowhere near as successful as when he was streaming Fortnite every single day for, like, 700, 800 days in a row. Right? <sighs> I saw that happen. I think the worst. I think the worst version of that I ever saw happen was uh, Destiny and Warframe. Uh, people who people who built up their channels for Destiny and Warframe, um, and started to branch out. Uh, people people got like mad. No, okay, that was the worst. Like so, like society like like subject wise. But the, wor the worst one ever, ever, ever was when Marcus, a.k.a. Epic Name Bro, stopped playing Dark Souls. Um, people got, like, furious. Fur like, like, angry, mean comment, furious. It was nuts. And he was like, listen, guys, I've run... Like I remember, like like he he did like a video where he's like I've tested the stats on every weapon in Dark Souls. Here's the chart, and people were like, "Stream more Dark Souls," and he's like, "There's nothing left. There's there's no more." <laughs> Dotto is eternally chained to Destiny. Oh man. So, Monkeyweed mentions a guy named Dotto. Dotto makes absolutely great Destiny 2 content, right? When I was playing Destiny 2, when, when you're playing Destiny 2, I would say it is, like, mandatory to follow Dotto's channel because he does really, really good stuff. And he was so into Destiny 2 that he, like, helped hurt Destiny 2. Um, because he was making content for like four or five days a week. And he was like, I have everything that there is to get. And the new syst and the new, uh, the new content comes out and I blow through it with my super pro raid group. And he gets all every new gun. And he had like this vault of like everything you could ever want in destiny Two. And he's like, there's nothing left in this game. Um, old players need something to work towards, but there's nothing to work towards because uh, I have a vault full of incredible stuff. And so Dato and some of the other community members for um, uh, Destiny 2 were like, uh, the devs have mentioned sunsetting. I think that sunsetting and giving your... your, your, um, your weapons a shelf life would be really strong for the game because it would push people to regrind certain pieces of gear and gear would be exciting and they could balance it to be super powerful. And he was like the biggest voice in the community to push that. 
He was the loudest. And then um, they put Sunsetting in. And then I stopped playing Destiny. And I checked out his channel six weeks later. And it was the video that I I absolutely knew was going to happen. And it was a video of him going, I don't know why I even play anymore. Every cool gun I get, I just know is going to be gone in nine months. Um, nothing's exciting. Um, I don't, I don't know why I'm even playing. And it was like, it was this, it was this, it was crazy. It, it was, it was why, because like there was this huge proportion of people in that community that were like, this will kill the game. You can't, you can't make people excited for temporary rewards ever. Temporary rewards suck. The, the angriest I have ever heard uh, anyone play World of Warcraft was um, when my friends were playing Classic during the run-up to Onyxia, and they were sitting there logging on so that they could be part of, like, the world train to fucking min-max get every world buff so that they could steamroll Onyxia, and how the fight with Onyxia had been moved from like a four hour encounter to three and a half hours of get every world raid and then go and do the fucking massive encounter in like 40 minutes and having someone fuck that up and have all the prep disappear and then have people that weren't good enough to do the Onyxia battle without the world buffs. And it's like, yeah, temporary shit sucks. It's bad. Nobody, nobody, nobody likes temporary buffs. <sighs> anyway. And that's why sometimes people don't play variety on their channels. All right. Kevin's lunchbox kicked in a sub. Thanks, man. Decided to buy Dwarf Fortress after your stream. Was going to wait till after Christmas, but I needed to suffer. Good for you. Spend half a day getting world buffs to kill next year in two minutes. That World of Warcraft Classic makes no sense to me. For one thing, that game has no future, which is like really depressing. Um, but the second thing is that like it's been solved. Like a lot, a lot of the a lot of the difficulty of early World of Warcraft was like people didn't know how to play MMOs, and now people really do. People really do. Right? So, like, like... I'm thinking back to, like, Rage Fire Chasm, and I, like, I literally can't even think of a single mechanic in Rage Fire Chasm other than don't overpull. I know that's, like, a level 16 dungeon, but still. Game's gone buggy, kicked in five bucks. Thanks, man. Royal kicked in five bucks. Thanks, Royal. Hey, Piss Profiteer Pat, River City Girls 2 is pretty cool, just along Marion, she's awesome, no clue why it's locked to 30 FPS though, please stop dunking your feet and pee, think of the children. Yeah, I am not hearing good things about River City Girls 2. I'm hearing that some of the voice acting is like, mid to bad, and that the game is locked to 30 FPS, and it, for no reason. They already fixed it? That's That's really strange. How did it ship like that? Because Way Forward typically releases things like, like, like fucking tip top. <sighs> Lord of Trades kicked in five hundred bits. Thanks, man. Reminds me of when I was a call center manager. Was doing call listening for my employees and overheard one beating the living shit out of her kid on a call, called CPS. That's rough, buddy. I've never seen that, but what I have seen is the prelude to the ass whooping because I worked at the grocery store. I'm sure all of you have seen the prelude to the ass whooping. Right? The the fucking mm. Tarek Bot kicked in. <laughs> A sub says sell your soul for the dog shit. I will. <sighs> Red the Baron kicked in a sub. Says, yo, yo, man. Hello. And Shiro kicked in seven bucks. <sighs> mm, 
you know, now it hits me that this is like 30 years old, Shiro. Like 30, maybe 35 years old. <sighs> Shiro writes in, to hit armor class zero, the number that your dice needs to be equal to to succeed. You subtract your armor class from that number. If the armor class is a negative number, you add it. It's stupid, but that's what it is. I will, I will never. Okay. I'm going to D and D nerds in the chat. I know you're in here. You're watching a video game stream on a Thursday night. All right. D and D nerds. I don't know. Don't also don't tell me. I don't know how to hit is calculated in modern Dungeons and Dragons, but I'm going to ballpark it. Okay. I am going to create how I think to hit should work in Dungeons and Dragons right now. Okay. You have an armor class of 15. You need to roll 15 plus or minus your buffs to hit it. 20 hits automatically. Is that how it works? Yeah. What? Like, why? Why would you ever do Thacko? Like. Like, fuck, dude. Like, it's this. It's like, it's so simple. Like, oh my god. Nerds made it? Yeah, but... Also, one is an auto-fail. Nah, one and natural... One and nat 20 is... Uh, I don't play D&D, but I have played D&D games. And uh, nat 1 and nat 20 are... Like, my favorite dice roll ideas ever. Ever. It's, gr it's like... It's always hit, always miss, no matter what it is. <laughs> like, no matter no matter what it is, it it worked. <sighs> hey, Grim Sora, subscribe. Thanks, man. All right, let's play a little bit of Choo Choo Charles. Don't know how much I'm going to play tonight. I am still very exhausted. I, did, I slept very poorly. But, uh, oh, you know what? We're going to wait a few minutes to play Choo Choo Charles as I forgot to install it. I came over here earlier today and I was like, I got to install Blacktail and Choo Choo Charles. And then I installed Blacktail and then left. <laughs> uh, did I see the Baldur's Gate panel from hell? I did not. What happened to the Baldur's Gate panel from hell? What happened? Hmm. I'm installing it on Wi-Fi 6. That's right. Matt Mercer is voicing Minx. Oh, that's cool. Oh, hey, O2 Hero sub. I was reminded today that when Hades first early, hit early access, the dash had no iframes and had a delay. Yeah, that game had a... <laughs> that is like the most improved thing. Oh man, what a great, what a great fucking game. I really hope that, um, I really hope that, uh, Zag's moveset is added to, um, Hades 2. Right? Twitter's banning CNN, New York Times, and Washington Post journalists now. What did fucking eh, did fucking pictures of Elon on the Epstein Island come out or something? Uh, 
Oh, they were already out? Okay. The hypothesis is the journalist in question embarrassed Moss. Free speech is back, brother! <laughs> uh. Hey, a peed kicked in five bucks. Thanks, a peed. Appreciate it. <clears throat> what a bunch of stupid shit. All right. He, yeah, he's mad that he got his ass booed off stage. Boo earns. Boo earns. All right, I downloaded the choo choo, Charles. Wait, what? Am I fucking blind and stupid? I think I just loaded up fucking Blacktail again. Wait, did I? Did I just uninstall? Wait. How was it? That's so weird. When I installed Choo Choo Charles, the Blacktail part didn't uh, come back up. Now we're going to play Choo Choo Charles. Okay, there we go. Pat's brain is dying. Brother, my d brain is dying every day. Every day. Well, thanks for the, thanks for the, um, I wonder. This wouldn't happen to have controller support, would it? Ah, oh, it does! Hell yeah, bro! Controller support! Hell yeah! It's the old getting to him? Dude, I'm so old. Um, it says it's got controlly support, but yeah, I ain't getting no controllies. Anyway, display. Good enough for me. Good enough for me. Good enough for me. Good enough for me. That's a good FPS right there. I love it. What does this say? Oh, that's a great little button for language. Because it's like, I don't know what that is. All right. Let's start a new game. I know it's been a while since we last spoke, but something has happened at the mines I've been supervising. No, trust me, you'll want to make time for this. You're looking for something big to keep your museum in business. Well, there's something big on that island. Real big. So many friends. And even my own son are still out there. If anyone can bring this thing down, it's you. It'll be the biggest attraction your city's ever seen. And you can Oh, no lip syncing at all, huh? Yes, meet me on the docks at sunset. I hope you're ready for a little monster hunt. I absolutely love how <laughs> I want I want no explanation yes, as to what Charles sir. is. They call him Charles. Holy shit. From hell. We've been planning his demise for some time now and have nearly everything in order. Just a few people to meet, places to see. Simple errands, you know. <laughs> oh my god, the sensitivity yes, is so high. Welcome to Erinirum, the island where miners dig their own graves. Stay close. Charles isn't the only thing to Why was it so here. extreme on the boat? It was so crazy on the boat. But now it's like a video game. Is it kind of low? Is it just you? Oh, you know what? <sighs> I did have the sound down a little bit. Sorry, guys. Someone must have changed. It wasn't me. There's a train shed at the top of the hill. One of the train operators was killed early on by the beast. The fact that he doesn't. So his old engine move. should be in there. If we can get to it, 
It could be an indispensable How much do I know about this game? All I know about this game is that there's an evil train. Stay close. That's literally You're all I know. Exposed for too long. All I know is that there's an evil train. And I think it was made by one gentleman. Explosion. Nothing to, more to lose here. Made up my mind to swim to the mainland and try. I likely won't make it, but I see my chances being higher out there than on this forsaken rock. Yeah, that old guy. Oh no, we're not doing this. Oh, you f absolute. You. piece of shit you piece of shit you bastard it's not sprint toggle wait it is sprint toggle wait no it, it is wait what what it's but it wait what it's sprint toggle but then it's Sometimes it's sprint toggle, sometimes it's not sprint toggle. Hey, look at that. Why? Why? Why do you have to hold it? That's so weird. That is the strangest version of Sprint Toggle I've ever seen in my life. If you hold down the Sprint button, it's- you hold it while you're sprinting. If you click it, it's a toggle. That is the strangest- that is the strangest. It rules? Why does it rules? I keep going to click it, but it, I click it too long. Ah, oh, shucks, it's locked. It is locked. Not to worry, we can still find a way in. There's a small shack up the path that might have a key inside. Take this map, I just marked the location on it. See if the key is up there, and I'll look around some more down here. Holy shit, that was intense as fuck. Blue arrow marks your location. White lines mark the train track. Red arrows mark splits. NPCs are marked. Uh, waypoint, mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. This is intense. Oh, also, this is actually just an aerial view of the game. Whoa. Place waypoint. I did it. It's so strange to me that left trigger is the button. I think being on a wire connection helps that toggle. I am on a wire connection right now, bro. I don't stream off of Wi-Fi. That would be crazy. I did it. Inventory. I should totally stream a random stream off of Wi-Fi and just see what happens and see if anyone notices. I bet no one would notice. Cause, cause here's the thing: the I'd be able to tell if it made any difference because I have OBS here and OBS has dropped frames zero percent on it, right? 
and it would it tells me that my frames are dropped by zero percent. <laughs> Good on you. Looks like you found it. Open up that door and lead the way. Oh, I don't have to actually. <sighs> Hey, that's what I'm talking about. She's an oldie but a goodie. I'm going to inspect the train's exterior. Why don't you take a peek inside? See what we got to work with. What router did I get? I don't know. It's some Shaw thing. It looks like a fucking... Looks like a gray obelisk. It's very fancy. God, that fucking freaked me out. The one with the four antennas? No, it is literally just like a... a, a, a standing rectangle. Your epic train. <laughs> Navigate the island, weapon and shield against your foes. Your respawn point if things go wrong. Infinite ammo. Okay, first things first. There we go. Oh, I see. Paint. Forward. Back. Brake. Train health. Speed train. Damage train. Armor train. Well, the exterior is a little rough, but everything looks to be intact. That gun you were looking at wasn't on here when I was evacuated from the island. But it sure looks fun to use. <laughs> we can light up Charles with it and take him down before he even sees us coming. Are you ready to take this thing for a spin? Yeah. Center make it go forward. Right lever, stop at the train. Left do the bid the back of the train. Here we go, motherfucker. Whoa! Yeah, baby! We're coming for you, Charles! Yeah, fuck you, Charles! It's really hot! Oh! Remove the waypoint. How do I remove a waypoint? You can't remove a waypoint. Was that death preventable? I fucking don't think so. Oh man, I'm having trouble with these map controls, bro. Alright, well... Let's, let's go. Oh, there's no time stop, huh? Stop! What's that? Is 
Is that scrap? Hell yeah. Bro. Bro, I'm scared. Bro, I'm scared of Charles. He's very scary. Hello. Huh. Nothing, huh? Guys, he, I'm pretty sure Charles ate that guy's corpse. <gasps> ah! I thought that was a jump. I thought I jumped. actually want to go there, but... But... Hello? Alright, I got seven scraps. Time for damage. And armor. My does my train look different? Can't tell. Wow, this is stressful. Charles is scary as fuck, dude. The fuck is all this shit? You hearing this? You just chilling, bro? You must be the archivist that Eugene told us about. You just chilling? We're happy that you came to help us out of this predicament with Charles and that madman Warren. You know, that old train of yours will need some major upgrades if you want to take down Charles. There are some metal scraps in my barn that you could use to improve it. But... Here's the key to the barn. It's just up a path, but I'll mark it on your map anyway. Oh, it's on a land path. I see. Okay, Pat's the only person I've watched that didn't go check the dude's body. Does the dude's body have an item on it? Yes? Really? Oh, let's go get this and... He has dying words?! Get out. Oh, we can go back. I don't like this. I'm super far from my train. Ooh, nine scraps. In here. Chicken feed, goat feed, fencing supplies, scratch all that. No need to <laughs> feed or fence the animals that have already been eaten. Even though Eugene's promised to send help once he reaches the mainland, I just realized he never mentioned if he'd come back. I suppose he's the type of person to ignore the fine details of a plan. Everyone on the island's trying to find a way out, and I can only hope this archivist friend can work some magic. 
Don't care what strange things they've done before or what practices they use, as long as Charles ends up dead. Most folks around here want the same, but there'll be those crazies that want to leave him be. That darn Warren has lost his marbles. Stupid Warren. Got it. Now I have resources, I can make my train better. I'm super fucking... I'm super worried. Fuck! I fucking keep hitting that button wrong. I got it, thank you. Um, speed, damage. All right, well, I just realized, I just realized that there's no good way for me to turn around. I'm gonna have to do a full loop-de-loop -loop to get that guy's body. Where is he? Where is he? Is he yellow lever? Reverse is a thing, but how am I... How am I gonna... How will I defend myself from Charles if I'm going backwards? You don't? That's a problem for future Pat? Damn it, I guess it is. I feel like I go slower backwards. Charles can come from any direction. And that gun rules, dude. Oh, I don't like that. Okay, so there's that. Charles can even appear behind me as my wife delivering food? Is that true? Oh my god. Wasn't it around here? I don't know where his body is. Where'd he go? I, I missed him. So what I miss out on anyway? Content? The main qu- get out. Are you serious? <laughs> All right. Yes, 
sir. They call him Charles. Half trained. Oh my god, why is it like this? Hell. We've been planning his demise for some time now and have nearly everything in order. Just a few people to meet, places to see. Simple errands, you know. <laughs> All right. Yes. Let's see if is there a body over there? Eridirum, the island where miners dig their own graves. Stay close. Charles isn't the only thing to fear around here. There is. I didn't even notice that the first time. Did I just save scum this There's droopy train gain? I did. Oh, the game will... Sorry. The, the train will stop if I jump off. Oh, cool. That'd be really funny if there's no body after this. Oh, yeah, really funny, huh? Like how I can scroll up and ban everyone who told me to go back because I'd miss content. I definitely didn't lose. To, ah. Yeah, baby. We're coming for you, Charles. It's still weird that he has. It's him. It's him. It's still absolutely wild that he has. Um. He's not taking it up. Oh, I didn't realize. Oh, okay. <laughs> this isn't how things were supposed to end. I thought we could still fight like the old days. Yes, sir. Easy in, <laughs> easy out. You'll need to do more than I thought, but. <laughs> I don't have it. So it's fine. Find the eggs. Find my Find the eggs. Find my Okay, well, that is actually, actually pretty helpful. All right, fuckheads, you win this round. You win this round. Fuckheads. Hey, hold up. Yeah. All right. Well, while that's happening. Oh wait, there was a. Wow, this does go quite slow. Dude, wasn't there a fucking... I feel like there was a box of shit. To my right or left at some point. I feel like it was before the campfire. Random spawn? Oh, man.
Oh yeah, the instant you hit the ground. Oh fuck! Man, every time, huh? You must be. We're happy, you know. We. How is Pat? Pat as well. Thank you, Paige. I traded the understanding the main objective for two boxes of scrap. Yeah, I'm kind of pissed off about that, actually. Oh, how's the game? Oh, it's good, honey. I thought you cared about the, you know, the well-being of your husband. Hey, by the way, Paige is in chat now. Hey, Paige, are you going to absolutely, like, blow my ass open if I try and mess with the Wi-Fi Ethernet situation tomorrow via cheat via cheating. She will not allow me to cheat the Wi-Fi situation. This is how you know I am going to honestly do the Wii feet. <sighs> well, he's going to be so embarrassed. You know he's going to be so embarrassed, dude. Have you seen Charles? Yeah, I see him in the intro. Ah! I can see him. Ah! Ah! That Charlie! Prepare mid fight? I didn't know that. Where am I gonna get enough? Oh no. Oh no. I'm fucked. So upset. I'm so upset. I lost my resources. I'll never get enough scrap. Never get enough. What is I literally got double that I lost? Yeah, but look. Okay. You know what happened just now? I had to use all that scrap to heal myself. 
I would have had that scrap for free. You're weird, lady. I need my pickles! Oh, it's my wife. This li we literally did this this, this morning. This is exactly what happened this morning. I would have gotten them hours ago, but I lost my pickle cave. Yeah. Someone that it Paige, you're right. That's even how she moves pickles. when she talks. I mean, lock picks. And if you can bring me my special jar of pickles, I'll give you all the scrap metal I have as a reward. That is fairly uncanny, I have to admit. Bro, how am I... Bro. How am I supposed to go... And get that? That shit is... That is deep in the non-train town. That is deep in not train. There's paper lore on the table. Man, I'm bad at this today. So I'm really, I'm really fucking tired. Like, my brain is, is fried. I did not get much sleep. Pickles. I love the pickles. That is a, I'm just realizing that is a deadly premonition joke. I don't know, Paige. Do you think you could sue for your, your pickle likenesses? Paige was supposed to bring me a coffee, like, three hours ago, but she never did. I understand, though. <laughs> yeah, I know, honey. I'm just- I'm busting your balls. Don't worry about I got the scrap. Everybody stop yelling. Well, the scrap really blends in a lot of spots. Is that purple paint? Bro. Bruh. Purple paint. Oh, wow. Pickle. Got it. Oh, fuck me. I came all this way without having the lock pick. I don't know where to get the lock pickles at. Is that just one of those things I will just have to figure out? I'll just have to find it naturally. Somewhere to the east. Boy, that's not clear at all. Scrap. I'm so upset. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. I'm being really brave. 
Oh, she doesn't have anything to say about the lock pickles. Well, definitely. Uh, well, you know what? Let's get this guy. No, this guy first. Well, at least I did get the ping. You're right. Five scraps. Oh. All right. Which way is it going to go? It's going to go that way? Perfect. Perfect. Oh, there's a building there. Might as well go check out the, the building. And then loop around back. Oh. Unloading all the supplies has been incredibly eye-opening. Here at the port, we've been working all day, every day. We're tasked with unloading the boat and running supplies up the hill to the tracks where Theodore and Eddie deliver them to different sites we'll be mining. The sheer cost of all this infrastructure is mind-blowing. All the success warrants me. He's had in this business. I'm surprised he's choosing to take such a risk here. Oh, fuck. That button's scary. I hate that button. I'll never get enough scrap. Never. You honk the train, you can see if Charles is close by. Oh, because he'll respawn. Can Charles kill you when you're not on the train? I bet he can. I bet he totally can. But that's his favorite thing to do. Great paint. Hey dude, what's up? My goodness, the others actually convinced someone to come help us. I'm so glad you came, but I simply cannot stay any longer. This island is too much for my nerves to handle. I've brought all my belongings here so I can leave immediately when a boat arrives. Although now that I think about it, I did forget my journal at home. Could you bring it to me? It's a day. Oh my god, you're sure, completely right, Hitchhiker. He does sound like a Black Mesa scientist. I'll give you all the scrap metal I have. Just please bring the journal next time you're here. Oh, that's not bad at all. Yeah, Paige, I don't think this was too complicated for you to play. It's actually fairly simple. Page accessible. Ooh, hello, it's a man. 
been praying that somebody from the first group would send back another boat. Guess they all think the Georgia supply boat's still evacuating people. They're all safe and cozy on the mainland, but feel no obligation to make sure everybody else escapes. I know that Charles sinking the boat isn't something anybody would expect, but still, to think, I would have left this place by now. It makes me sick. Alright. Back we go. Time to go. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. Fuck. The island is not shaped like a dinosaur. God damn it. All right, 16 scraps. That means, boop. I'm getting there with the speed. Huh, I just remembered. Hell yeah, purple train, yeah! Hell yeah, purple train. That's a baller fucking train right there. Baller train right there. You know what I'm saying? Ball. Oh. Gotta switch this shit. Let's roll. Purple train. Is it going left? Great. Don't think he's anyone near me. I gotta say, the, um, out of all the dumb shit fucked up moron jokes I've ever heard in my life, the one that seems to be getting the most mileage out of my brain is um Beyonce. Fucking moronic. I'm really enjoying the ambiance. Say, you're that monster hunter. I must know, do you have any experience with ghosts? No. Someone or something has been pinning exactly 16 drawings to lampposts in the boulder field every night. I always collect and burn them, but as I was looking for them last night, I began hearing strange noises and seeing strange things. I only found half of them yesterday because of the commotion. Could you go find the last date and bring them to me? <sighs> That's cute. For the past seven days, there have been some strange happenings in the boulder field. A week ago, I went over there to clear my mind. So I often do, and found the strange drawing pinned in a lamppost. I took down the page and burned it because it seemed like the best way to deal with paranormal paper. Next night I found more drawings and burned them as well. I found exactly 16, multiple nights in a row. Now they're accompanied by horrific, ghastly noises. I don't feel safe going out. May I have guess, best guess that they're haunted? Maybe by your lost crew members? Maybe by something else? That's fucking hilarious. That's fucking hilarious. Well, there's a building. What is that? Dude, you can see scrap on the fucking map. This looks evil. Where the fuck's the journal? Aha. Journal acquired. Alright. Fuck. I'm spooked. I'm fucking spookified. Ok. 
Can Charles get into buildings? That's a great question. Oh. Oh! Looks like I'm good for a bit. Looks like I'm good for now. Is that a good idea? People tell me if Charles will let me know if he's there. This is great. This is great. Holy fucking shit! Ah! Fuck you, bitch! Damn you, wife! This is the least cool thing ever. I'm gonna get her back so fucking bad. Whoa. Oh, I don't actually even get hurt. Well, that's- that's nice. trouble uh I'm having trouble so this was always my problem with the slender man is that uh you get to the part where you're like I don't know where the remainder of the pages are <laughs> pardon The only page I have to worry about is behind me. All right, that's pretty fucking funny. I feel like he's getting faster. Page is more speed, that makes sense. <sighs> yeah, the sound design on this not Slender Man is pretty good. He sounds pretty mean. I'm just gonna assume time's. Oh! There's no time stop. Six out of eight. Better know where I'm going? Bro, I don't know where I'm going. 
Oh, now I see. It's at the bloody ones. Right? Is that? I don't know why I didn't put that together. Hey! Seven! Charles! Oh. Do I get scrap from damaging him? I do. Let's go back. Oh, that was scary. Is Pat breathing hard? Yeah, dude, that's scary. Charles is a scary ass bitch. Pat doesn't like trains or spot. Oh, 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 oh! Trains work. Going this way, I suppose. Interesting. Getting there. <sighs> Train stop. Okay. Need to write this theory down fast before Warren finds out the Mondo's dirty plot. My theory is that Mr. Warren, Warlord III, trying to hatch and raise more of these eight-legged critters. A whole army of who knows for what purpose. They found a whole nest of those while clearing out debris from the cave-in. Who knows what... We also know their hardest diamond, completely indestructible. The miners spent months using the temple prism to suck the energy out of all the eggs. Before they could destroy the last three, Old Man Warren stopped them. Warren must have realized how powerful these things are, and rather than t protect us from them, he wants to use them to take over the world! I I'm sure Eugene told you all about me, so I need not introduce myself. I N name's Greg, by the way. I in case you haven't heard already, Warren, the mine boss, is keeping three monster eggs locked away. We're unsure why he wants to protect the eggs. If they hatch, they would surely turn into monstrous creatures like Charles. To prevent this, we, we need you to steal all three and, and use them to bait Charles 
so we can destroy him. Uh, one, one of the eggs is, is in the north mine. Uh, here's, here's the key to the entrance. Okay. Got it. We weapon mission. We weapon. 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 I want that. Paul asked me to design a new weapon to help you hunt Charles. And using my extensive demolitions experience, I made this rocket launcher. I've been wanting to see Warren's empire crumble for a long time. So building this puppy was a hell of an opportunity. Now that you're here, I need a few minutes to remove some safety features. While I'm working on that, why don't you bring that box of rocket ammunition back here from inside the bunker down the rail? Okay. Well, I'm doing this mission. Stuck debating if Warren made us bring our families to this hell hole so we didn't ever need to leave to keep information about his business practices away from the mainland. Either way, I want this man in a noose. Paul asked me to design a new weapon for the monster hunter that Eugene's sending. And knowing what I do about explosive, I bet I made the most powerful rocket launcher I could. Warren, you don't stand a chance. Alright, before we actually go do that, um, I'm gonna go hang out down here. Uh, there we go. Might as well pick up these missions so that if I have to go somewhere, I can do it. Scrap. More scrap. Man, Charles is fucking... Charles is scary. Huh. Please deliver a copy to Paul. I went outside to do a routine check at the lighthouse. Walked around the corner and saw that beast Charles. He spotted me and charged straight up the hill in my direction. Spider trains a hideous monster. Can't understand why Warren wants to stay in Aranium instead of trying to escape it. Suppose Warren has simply gone crazy, thinking he can handle it on his own. In any case, Charles ran right over me, trampling my leg. I'll be able to attend the upcoming meeting if you ask Greg to bring back a copy of your notes, if possible. We haven't met, but I've heard lots about you coming to help us. I have a favor to ask. The breakers on the side of the lighthouse need replacing. I was recently attacked by Charles, so I'm unable to do it myself. The breakers are in the nearby supply shed. If you go get them and repair the lighthouse, I can try signaling passing ships to come help us. Once you finish, I have some spare scraps to give you. Okay. That seems... easy. Am I crazy that that seems super easy? Okay. I. All right. I, I got him. Wouldn't Charles just destroy your train while you're away? He only hates life, it seems. Fixing the lighthouse will definitely increase our chances of being spotted. Here are those scraps I promised. Nailed it. Oh, now the lighthouse is like visibly a lighthouse. Hooray. Uh, yeah. I think that's my train. Ow. Oh, that was squishy. 
how long does the SF6 beta go for? Till Sunday night, I want to say. What's it starting anyway? About three hours? Cool. Hmm. I could run down there. It seems like it would be easier to just drive. Looks like we're good. Hello, dynamite. Not sure what you're for, but okay. Explains that. Name. How the fuck did Charles get in here? Got it. Version one failed. Version two failed. Version thirteen. Second flight. Version four success. All right. Let's let's do it. We. All right. Let's roll. I feel like go you go way faster forward than you do backward. Is that my mind playing tricks on me? The launcher is in complete working order, so I'll let you take it from here. Oh, and take good care of it. After you're done, I have a few people to visit with it if you catch my drift. Rocket launcher acquired. Fuck yeah. Damage. There's four weapons. Alright, so... Oh! Yo. Yo. All right, what next? Didn't I get the journal? I feel like I did. Gotta return it before that part goes away. Got it. Journal. Thank you. Oh, it goes there, right. Uh, 
All right, let's back up to before the switch. There we go. Yep. Got it. One more to go. Bro, you starting early, huh? We... Oh, fuck. Damn it. Damn it. I am trying very hard to find the last page, but I am having a difficulty. Having a strong difficulty. I'm wondering if it's in a weird, uh, weird spot or some shit like that. Uh oh. He's gonna get me. Damn it. Guys, tell me where it is. I passed by some. Go for lit lampposts? I am going for lit lampposts. Watch out behind you. Mm. Thank you, that's great advice. That's really good advice, thank you. Have I checked my butthole? Skip that but that butthole. Oh, come on. Come on. Got it. So the answer was that it was actually further along than I usually um, go. We thanks for the thanks, thanks for, for the, the gift subs, Graves. Oinky, oinky, pig, 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 time. Oinky, oinky. <sighs> thanks to you too, Panda, for the five gift subs. Oink. Oink you. Oink pig, no, pig, pig noise. <sighs> this is Paige's fault. Somebody asked me earlier, hey, what do I think about 6.3? All I know about 6.3 is I'll have to spend the entirety of it as a potato. Thanks for bringing me those papers. Here are some scraps for your help. Entire, entirety. <sighs> like, I really hate it a lot. It's gonna be like that till... 7.0? No, it'll be like that till 6.4. The bet was for all of 6.2 and all of 6.3. Going right back to goddamn row after that.
But the point is that I have to do all the story content on stream for 6.4 as a potato. <sighs> Row, not bunny? Dude, I'm getting- I'm going all the way back. Well, that was a little rough. Uh! Pardon. We... Oh, shit. Thank you so much for bringing my journal. I would hope, for your own good, that you didn't peek inside. But, um, here are those scraps I promised. Hooray, we did it. We fucking did it. Alright. They were all pictures of him kissing a train. Where the fuck's the, where's my tra ah, there you are. Whee. Alright. So I'm rewinding back to the crossing and then taking a left. Nice blue train. Go to hell, all of you. You're all fucking color freaks. Alright. Let's get this next one. Interesting. Can I open these? It's a train station. That is not a piss blue train. Oh my god, you fucking people are sick. Alright. Hello. Oh, hey man. What's up? His blue is Pat. Oh, let's see. Welcome to Araniram, archivist museum person. My apologies. I'm not the best with introductions, but I don't believe either of us are here for socializing. I just so happen to have a little business opportunity, if you're interested. A very special little box of mine is in a rail car in the nearby canyon. But the goons have set up a camp to protect that area. Find the blue box and bring it back to me. I'll give you some scraps as payment. The goons? Fuck! There he is. Oh, is he? Wait, is he gonna come straight for me? Or I 
that's where I want to go, Charles. Hey, oh, what's up? Oh! This woman, I swear. Uh, this game rules. You should go buy it. It's cheap. It's really good. It's a really cool game. Paige, can you give me my lights back, please? As normal. Alright, let's thank you to Peepo. Again, thank you Red Panda and Graves for kicking in five gift subs. Appreciate it. Kane Highwind subbed. Hey Pat, why do we get our odds? Blah, blah blah. That's where I'm at. Hey Pat, why do our odds make such good musicians? Because they're familiar with their scales. Go to hell. Straight to hell. Uh, Crimson Kyle subbed also it says, "I love the idea of the game. I think this game is hilarious, but also like actually a ton of fun." All right. What the fuck is this? Is fucking Vinny playing Pokemon? What the fuck? All right, go say hi to Vinny. He's playing Pokemon. So I should play Pokemon. Do you guys like it when people play Pokemon? Is that a is that a thing? Do y'all you, you like that? Whatever. I'm out of here. I'm going to go take a massive shit. Okay, bye-bye.